Oh, hello, hello! Welcome in, everybody. How's it going? How's it going today? Ooh, I just saw coffee was live and I got distracted. <laughs> he's like somewhere. I think he's in North Town. I just opened his stream and I was just like, oh, what's going on? Hey, Gadget. Ah. Uh. Gadget, it says you're the current hype train conductor. Yo, that's some like, that's some epic stuff, man. Hello, how you doing today, Gadget? Um, give me a second. I'm still pulling up everything. Of course, of course, you know, you know. Uh, how is the? Oh, okay. Um, how are the times going, y'all? How's it? How's it been? Uh, hey, hi. How's it going? Welcome to your stream, Weird Lady. <laughs> uh, thanks, Gadget. Um, thank you. I appreciate it. I um, I discovered something today. I was on the YouTube's, as uh my granny would say, the YouTube's, and um, you know, I was uploading the new video, which I still I haven't even. I'm gonna be honest. I didn't even watch the full thing before I uploaded it because I was just on a really tight deadline. So let me know if it's okay. But anyway, uh, I think it just went live like two minutes ago. Uh, oh, seven minutes ago it was. Uh, so I'll just copy paste and link it for you guys. But um, yeah, that's why I'm late because it was taking forever to upload. Then I realized what was taking it so long was because I was uploading two videos. I was uploading a vod on my on my computer here, and then I was uploading the video on my laptop. So that's why. I'm late, so my bad. But anyway, obviously doing well if I'm a choo-choo person. <laughs> Heck yeah, Gadget, that's all that matters. Ooh, man. All right, um, but I finally... You guys are finally gonna see what it's like, my opinions on Warden, you know? Uh, things have changed, clearly. But it's wild. <laughs> Jonathan, he said, uh, you finally love me because I am a warden. <laughs> what? Um, yeah, so if you guys want to watch the video, it's there. I'm pinning it for y'all. So if you want to watch it, it's available. Or I can, you know, watch it later. Because we're streaming now. So, uh, hey, Kip. Aubrey the wise one. Why do you call me a wise one? I don't know about that. <laughs> Uh, but hi, Kip, how you doing? Jarnath, you said, I am a warden. Yeah, I mean, I have a newfound respect for warden. I will have the warden short coming out now because this was the video I was waiting so long because I was like, for the warden short for the charity stream, I told you guys that I would make a short explaining my viewpoints on warden. And I was like, wait, let me make sure that this goes live, this video goes up, and then I'll post the short because it just makes more sense that way. So... Um, yeah, Lewis, you said, good day, mate, in a strong Aussie accent. Okay, I don't think I did it justice, but I tried. <laughs> Jaron out there are very fun. They are fun on landscape difficulty, I will say. I, I liked, I liked my mar- or I almost said my mariner. I liked my warden on landscape difficulty. I actually really did enjoy warden on landscape. I'll admit it now. I can finally admit it to you guys. Okay, I'll, I'll admit it. Warden is not last on my tier list. We made our tier list, which is, I think it's going to be a whole video now of like, what's the worst class on my tier list lately? <laughs> uh, Kip, you said new, new, new moniker? What? I almost think you're trying to say monitor. A lost Shire have a hey, pokes head in Wallace thinking which character to log in. Honestly, me too. I gotta go on my room keeper. But man, <laughs> Jarna, she likes poses. <laughs> Lewis, great. Heck yeah. I'm glad you're having a, a good day, mate, you know? Uh, Gary, hey. Hello, all weirdos and weirdettes. Hello, Gary. How you doing today? Um, So I was on the YouTubes today, uh, right before stream, actually. Gadget, I just saw what you posted under the memes section of the Discord in response to what I said to a meme. And that was just horrifying to see just now. I don't want to gross anyone out by putting this out there, but it's like the movie Alien, okay? It, it, I pretty much just saw that. Oh. 
anyway, um, that was horrifying. So anyway, disregarding that, I went on the YouTubes and I saw a screenshot. I saw a thumbnail and I was like, oh, why the heck is that held for review? I'm sorry, Jardeth. I don't know what's going on with YouTube mod. Hey, sec Q, how's it going? I want to do a walk with you sometime. I missed the last one. Ooh, Kip, it's going to be a while till I walk, though. I'm not going to lie. We do have Monster Play. Uh, if you guys want to join, Monster Play is happening on my birthday. On Friday, April 12th at 6 p.m. EST, we will be doing Monster Play, which is totally free. It should be free for everybody. You just have to have a character at level 2 on the server that we play on. So that should be relatively easy for everyone. I think it's level 2. It's either level 2 or level 10, but it's really easy. But anyway, um, yeah, so we'll, we'll be doing Monsters if you want to join for that. I mean, it's totally, like I said, totally easy to do. Um... Which server? It's gonna be on Arkenstone, Kip. I do not play on Arkenstone, which is hilarious. Vin, thank you so much for the Prime sub! Thank you! Welcome! You're a weirdo weirdo now, Vane. You could say that with, uh, with pride. I'm a weirdo weirdo! <laughs> because I subbed! Thank you, Vane. I appreciate that Prime sub. That really helps a lot. A uh, Snorgar Arkenstone? Yes, we are going on Arkenstone because Arkenstone has one of the better um, MP uh, monster player versus player populations um, that's more active. So Arkenstone for that. Because if we were to go on Crick, I don't think we'd run into anybody. I mean, it's a Friday night, which would make it a little bit more likely, but still. Um, hi, okay, I need a walk song reward like Sally has so I could spam it for 10 hours, dude. I kind of felt bad, yo. I felt so bad, hi. Dude, you and I were spamming her walk, but like, a part of me felt bad, and then the other part of me was like, she can change it, it don't matter. <laughs> and then she did change it, and I was like, dang, I can only spam it like 12 times now. <laughs> Gadget, actually, it was a response to the alien face hugger meme, DK. Oh, yeah, 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 but I was like, what the heck is that? <laughs> okay, that makes more sense. Um, uh, Chris, Chris Blues, hello. Lives, uh, Lordeth of the Rings time, heck yeah. Kip, you said, was it Crick Hollow? You are normally on, correct, Kip. I normally am on Crick Hollow. Weird Hydrate, thank you, thank you, Chris. Thank you, and Hi's the first weirdo up in here. Let's go, Hi's on it. Ooh, thank you guys for the weird hydrate. Um, Snorgar, hello. Yes, hello to you. How are you doing today? I hope everyone's doing well. How's everybody doing? Um, okay, give me one second. I'm just trying to post on Discord before I go into story mode. Cause you know me, I wanna be I wanna be a weirdo stream if uh I didn't instantly start off the stream with the story. And this is about Star Wars. So if you're a Star Wars fan, I need you to listen, okay? I really need to discuss something here. I'm like bursting to tell you guys because my brain can't make it make sense. I can't make it make sense, okay? And then I swear, we'll, we'll be low tro, we'll be all in the Lord of the Rings stuff all the rest of the day, I swear. I just need to talk a little Star Wars. Hey, Bayman, how's it going? How you doing today? Hello, hello, hello. Uh, we will be stomping some shoes today for the uh, Spring Fest because I need to get going on that. I need to be done with my dailies. I need to be done with them. It's almost time. Bayman, oh boy. <laughs> Bayman's like, oh gosh, here we go again about the politics of S Star Wars. <laughs> oh boy. Um, <laughs> you said eh, it's going. Oh, okay. It's just it eh, going. Gadget, is it about hobbits? Uh, I mean, Ewoks? No, it's about Bad Batch. So, uh, I don't know if y'all know. Oh, Kip, your ears are wide open. Okay. So, uh, I don't know if, about you guys, but there is this show on Disney+. Plus. It's a Star Wars show. It's called The Bad Batch, all right? Now, if you watch Clone Wars, it, it's kind of... I would almost call it like a spinoff of a Clone Wars, but it goes over the stuff that's happening to a certain group of clones after the events of order 66 <sighs> flash forward to like now they're wrapping up i think i think this is the final season that they're basically almost done with now 
Uh, but the show, the show's done after this. And apparently in the season, I think we're on season three, I think it is. I don't watch the show. I watched one episode and I turned it off because I was very upset because they showed one person and they already like messed up the canon for that person. And I just got, I took it personally because I really like that person. And uh, yeah, anyway, so anyway, disregard. But yeah, I don't watch the show. Apparently in the trailer, they showed someone a very, you know, who was in the Clone Wars side character uh a female apparently she was in the trailer i didn't know this i'm just going through youtube i see this picture of this said person name starts with an a i don't want to spoil but like i was like hold on um so i look and then there are clips and like scenes of this person in the bad batch and i'm thinking to myself Hold on. What is my favorite Star Wars book of all time? And it's called it's called The Dark Disciple. Okay, you can look it up. But there's someone in that book and something very, you know, extreme happens to this person. <laughs> and this book takes place before Order 66. So I'm seeing something extreme happen to said person in said book. And I'm watching After Order 66, this person in Bad Batch, and I'm like, how does that happen? Long story short, I'm upset with Star Wars because they just can't leave characters alone, man. I'm getting tired of it. I'm really getting tired of Star Wars doing this. I'm just so upset because it just totally kills my book. It's like when you when you read something crazy happen to someone you followed for so long. Canon spoilers. Oh. Apparently, the book is still canon. That's what's crazy. I was like, oh, I guess they're just going to toss the book to the side, which honestly would not be surprised about. But apparently, because I did some digging, because I was just like the flip, and I don't want to spoil too much, Kip. But like... I'm actually quite upset. Hey, Bortbor, how you doing? Snorgar, you said doing great. The, the, the dentist actually went great. Let's go. For the first time in forever, she actually didn't say I had to brush better, which was genuinely surprising, but I'm happy about it. Heck yeah, Snorgar, let's go. Hey. Yeah, I remember you talking about it. You were being, like, stressed. <sighs> um, How am I? I'm doing all right today. Can't complain. I've been working, like, nonstop. I work four days in a row, which is unusual. I did get to leave an hour early, but like everybody around me got called off like all week and they were like, oh, this person's working like four shifts, so we should call them off and stuff. And then it was like me and they never called me off and I'm just exhausted. I feel like I have a thousand years of lore to catch up on. Yo, Kip, you know. I'm just so upset because this changes everything for people and... Like, I liked the book because I didn't care too much about the characters that were in this book. In the Dark Disciple book. It's a Star Wars book. But, like, I loved how they took the direction of these characters. It's like it's like if you were watching, like, some side characters in, like, a movie that you were like, eh, they're okay. And then they actually gave, like, the side characters, like, a really interesting story. Like, crap hits the fan. Their, their whole paths have, like, drastically changed. And then the, the person just shows up later, like, out of the blue, and, like, it's almost like none of that stuff happened. That's pretty much what I witnessed today. And I was actually, I was, it just really bummed me. Because that was, like, the one thing I just didn't want them to touch. And they freaking ruined it. They freaking ruined it all, y'all. Snorgar, I stopped watching Star Wars. Too much shows, too much to follow, just like Marvel. It's just too overwhelming. I'll stay with Doctor Who. Dude, Doctor Who is overwhelming to me. I try getting into Doctor Who, but I'm just so far behind. That overwhelms me. But I, I see what you're saying, though, because, yeah, Star Wars is like Marvel. I can't stand Marvel for that same reason. It's like you it's like you watch all of these big things, like all of these big shows or whatever that they put on, and it's like you only need, like, five seconds of, like, whatever you just, like, paid, like, $15 to, like, go and watch for, like, three hours. That was just ultimately crap. You only need, like, five minutes of that actual movie. 
<laughs> to actually make it make sense to like go into something else, but yeah. Uh, Gadget, you said they wiped out the old canon so they can rewrite everything. If you don't want to slowly watch lots of stuff change, look away. Yeah, bro. Dude, I know that they got rid of the canon, but this book came after... This came after when Disney had already gotten Star Wars. And this was actually... Um, well, this is, I think this is what happened. Correct me if I'm wrong. I'm not totally sure. Because the book that I'm referring to, it got published after Disney took over. However, it was the events that happened in the book were supposed to take place in Clone Wars Season 6 originally. But then Clone Wars got canceled, kind of because of the Disney like thing and whatever. And Season 6 got like you know released on Netflix or whatever, just the 10 episodes and they had to cut the events that happened in the book because they only had a few episodes in that the big it was like a big story arc for clone wars that it was supposed to be in season six so they couldn't put it in season six so they did actually start the process of animating some of it which they have shown to the public and they have clips of things that happen from the books but then they just turned it into a book because it was just easier that way i don't know but then that book got released, like, you know, post-Disney, whatever. And it's technically considered canon. So I did some research because I was like, this makes no actual sense. And pretty much what people were asking, because apparently in the trailer, people were confused just as me. And all the producers, whatever, on the show, they were just like, oh, well, it's all going to line up with the book. Which makes it sound like they're still keeping the book. I don't get how you can do that, though, because... <sighs> anyway. I can't give away spoilers, but if you read the book, something drastic happens to someone. And it's not something that I don't think you should just walk away from, I guess. Which apparently you can just walk away from now, <laughs> so... Like, basically, Star Wars is just going down the direction of... They just don't want to... They just love having characters for business. It's so much like Marvel lately. They could take everybody. They could take out all of their main, you know, Avengers people. But my golly, their Avengers people are still around in a different multiverse because they just have to make sure that they're still around somewhere because money. People will go see them. I don't know. <laughs> Like, uh, like, let's be honest, too. Okay, uh, I'm not dumb, okay? I'm starting to really fall out of Star Wars because they are going down that path of, like, multiverses. It's happening. We've seen it. I was really upset with Ahsoka because they go more into it there. I was really disappointed when they showed it in Rebels. And I was like, really, Dave? Really? We're really going to Marvel? And then they show it in Ahsoka. I was like, all right, y'all are, like, stamping the approval on it. So... Will not be surprised at this point. Ugh. Anyway, sorry. I just had to rant. I was just so I was so bumming. But anyway, spring festival, you know. Oh, <laughs> uh, oh! I should say too, guys. Um, there's a new coupon. There's a new coupon for Lotro. So if you guys uh need to know, uh, not nothing too crazy. If you ask me personally. But it could be helpful. Sorry, you said if you so if you ever want to try um, Doctor Who again, then you can come now. Highly recommend the reboot from 2005 has 13 seasons. It's a lot, but I'm I am the more Doctor Who, the better. Uh, but it may it will do a soft reboot and start from season one again. Wait, really? Dang, man. Dude, I didn't realize Doctor Who had so many reboots. Hey, Nick, how you doing? Hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. All right. Um, there are. Uh, when you see through their crappy model, that's you're done, right? Yeah, pretty. Yeah, pretty much, Lewis. <sighs> Which makes me so sad. I have a Star Wars tattoo. I was a diehard fan, guys. And now I'm just like, I I'm so disconnected from the franchise. I think pretty much once Andor season two comes out, which they said that was going to be the last season, which I'm kind of happy. I don't want them to mess it up and they would mess it up if they keep it going. But after season two, I think I'm done with Star Wars. Like there's absolutely nothing that looks interesting to me. And um, yeah.
I just can't believe it. I was just so obsessed. Oh, wow, the inventory slots are still on sale. Wow. Only for like 16 hours. Ooh, okay. So, um... Oh! Apparently, Shared Space says t the 10 slots are still on sale for seven days. Oh, this is for Shared Wardrobe Space. So that was the biggie that I saw that was on sale this week. Um, the Shared Wardrobe Space, you get 10 slots, which they did not have last week, which I did point out, and then they put it on sale this week, which makes more sense. Uh, so 25% off a Shared Wardrobe Space. Mounted Combat Trait Spec is also on sale. Which, uh, I don't really know why you would need that, because no one really uses mounted combat, I would assume. Oh, my cosmetic outfit slots are on sale. Bro, how do they know I need another cosmetic outfit slot? And it's an account-wide thing, too? Oh, bunny. Oh, I need Lotro points. I think my Lotro membership expires tomorrow. I'm kind of sad. I'm real sad though. Um Let me show you guys. Um Snorga, you said yeah, it's going to be on Disney Plus, but no no worry about Disney. They're only funding it as of now. So there is not a Doctor Who multiverse yet. Oh. Man, not yet, Snorga, not yet. I mean, it, they could easily do that, right? <laughs> Panda, you said Disney took the golden goose out of Star Wars and took it took it out back and shot it, sadly. That is a very depressing description. But you're not wrong, Panda. Gadget, you said that's the thing. Rewriting the canon is going to be messy, and they're in the mood to manhandle everyone. Add in that there's no longer one person at the top acting as final word. So everyone who gets involved is going to change what they think is in their way. Folks may not realize it, but they will miss Lucas. Bro, I miss him so much. Nick, I'm good. I hope you're doing well. Yeah, I'm doing okay. What were you up to tonight, Kip? You're hitting the hay soon. I'm just going to be doing Spring Festival tonight. Nothing too, too crazy. Uh Oh, Lashire Hobbit, you're on? Do, do, do. Who's on? Who out of my friends are on? Can I just invite you to a fellow? We don't have to do, like, anything too crazy, I guess, but... That way we're just grouped, I guess. Stormgrave, you said it's still owned by BBC, so it's more or less a collab, and the new trailer looks promising, but yeah, I had... To add the yet, just in case Disney decides to completely take Doctor Who over. Yeah, I'd not be surprised if they try, you know? Not one bit. Wow, I had so many spring leaves in here. Um, That's right! We need to do a lot of shrew stomping today, guys. That's what we're going to do a lot of today. I still have 200... Well, I'm at 220 shrews out of 400. You want an invite to Guild, Jarnoth? All right. Snorgar, you said in <laughs> yeah, Disney will take over and ruin it. Sorry, I had like, I had a hangnail on my foot and it hurt. Panda, you said uh, they reckon <laughs> they reckon Obi Wan to a female. I mean, I don't know what the frick happened with Obi Wan. Obi Wan's something else. I don't know what they did with that show. It it's just. We don't talk about that. Uh, go for it. I'll be switching characters at some point, but I'll move on uh, as when I do. All right, cool. Yeah, no problem. Let me know. Oh, the enormous shrew is running loose, everybody! Nobody's here! Aw, uh, this is the part in the festival where uh, absolutely no one cares anymore. Everybody's burnt out. The enormous shrew is just going wild, bro. I've actually never seen him like go the, like this mad. If only I could stomp on him right this second. Take the free big box. Oh! He can attack you outside of the arena. Bruh! He actually took damage off of me too! Nine common damage, bruh! What a 
douchebag. <gasps> a thousand figgies! Oh my god, yo! Oh, let's go! I spent all my figments, basically, last stream. And I just got a thousand. Oh my golly. I'm so happy. I'm so excited. Uh, Pandy said, after Cryogon Jin death, I stopped caring for any other character. Man, that was like... That was like 1999 ago, man. Like, Panda, you were like, I'm done. <laughs> 1999 here, you were like, I'm good, man. I'm screw, screw Star Wars, yo. <laughs> um, Jaranoth, he said, wait, thought you're on Arkan. No, I am not on Arkan. Uh, I did mention Arkan Stone for the monster play, but I'm actually on Krakalo, Jaranoth, sorry. A star guard you said, but sadly, most anticipated shows are flops. Amazon already missed the mark with Ring to Power, and there are just so much shows that are purely there for money. Forget creating great and moving stories, just make something people like and let the money roll in. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Still too soon, you say, Panda. Oh. It's been like, you know, several. It's been like 25 years. Aren't we going to celebrate like the 25 years of episode one? Or has the 25 years already passed? Some episode one is it 25 years? 25 years this year. Yeah. Yeah, I can math. There we go. I'm mathing. I'm making it math. It's making math sense to me now, you know? I'm trying to get. Well, maybe I should start earning towards my virtues again because I'm trying to get all of these done so i get the passive bonus but it's not really a big deal i would pick up these quests but i'm not going to well i guess i could well because then i'll probably accidentally do them okay absolutely no one is here is anyone doing spring fest drake thank you so much for the follow welcome to the weird community i hope you're having a good day today that reminds me i need to move my alert box back i will be changing my alerts soon uh, Gadget Kenobi is sad. It was free cash for Disney. All they had to do was make it primarily an Obi-Wan Vader chase across the galaxy thing and catch the checks. Somehow they had to get creative and they would screw that easy concept up. Yo, you're right though, Gadget. You're right. <laughs> B said, hello, friends. Hey, how's it going? I hope everyone's doing well today. Heck yeah. Yeah, we're doing well. Um, I'm actually kind of bummed. Nobody's here for Spring Fest in, uh, Dweeland. Oh, hey! Hey! There's one person! Oh, wow! It even looks like she has, like, a lateral armor for Rings of Power. It looks nice. Snorgar, could you teach how to ma match because you seem t Oh, can can you teach how to math because you seem to be mathing really well? Um, I don't know. I almost did go into- gosh, I changed my major so much. I originally changed my major to do, um... So when I originally went to college, I went for film and for pre-law. And my goal was to study copyright film because there is a college kind of near me that really goes into that. They specify and they like it's a it's not like a bad law school. It's not like a like high standard law school or anything, but like they have a decent copyright like law background and program. So I wanted to study copyright law like so bad. Um, but I dropped that and then I was like, I'm gonna be a math teacher. And then I, I never, I never did that either. So I can't, I can't help. B, I could come stand in there if you need me to. Yeah, B, like, I just need, I just need companionship. Like, this is just sad. I'm just happy. Okay, there's two of us now. I feel better. This would be very different if it was just me. But I have so many shrews to stomp, guys. I've got what? What's 400 minus 220? I've got, uh, um, um, uh, what is it? 180 shrews to stomp. So, um, that means that I have uh, 18 matches to go, right? I have 18 rounds of shrews to stomp today. Today through tomorrow. So, yeah, we got some work to do is what I'm saying here. 180. Okay, you guys are so quick on it and I took forever. Good for you, Gadget and Longshire Hobbit. Thank you. Um, Lashire Hobby said, I am just over the maze getting leaves ready to switch to anniversary tokens. Ooh. That reminds me, I should get my the rest of my festivity tokens today. I'm at 20 and 40. I would really like to just max it out so then that way for midsummer, I'm ready to go and I can get some stuff. You know what I'm saying? We're on it. We're on it. 
can't believe that's 18 rounds of shrews to stomp. Dude, that sounds like forever. That's probably gonna take like two hours in itself. Oh. So I'm trying this new um, sparkling water. It's called Berry Lemonade. So guys, for my birthday next month, April 12th, Friday, we're doing monster play. I spoke with Jules and Coffee. We're also gonna do Dwarven Ladies Night that night. I'm hoping to have like a long stream day. That's pretty much what I want to do for my birthday. I'm like, I just want to stream like all day. I want to get cupcakes for myself and eat Chipotle, maybe get some Starbucks or something and just stream Lotro all day. <laughs> Does that sound like a plan? I want to go live like super early and then like, like 12 hours easy. 12, a 12 hour stream easy, guys. This is not bad, berry lemonade. I'll come over once I'm done in the maze. No worries, Lost Shire Hobbit. No worries. I have competitors. I have th three people to compete against, so I mean, it's A-OK. -okay. Plus, I still need to go to Sergeant Tom anyway and get the dailies, because I do want to get that credit for that. I do need my spring leaves, because I do need more cosmetic pets. Dude, so are you guys, like, is everybody here in the chat, are you all, like, pretty checked out of, like, Springfest? <laughs> I feel like I should be, but I'm not. I'm actually shocked. Normally, by now, I'd be, like, so over even Winterfest, because I freaking love Yuletide. But, man, I do get burnt out doing it so often, so much. Dude. All right, just time to stomp, stomp, stomp with my non-existent boots. I'm just literally spam clicking. And I can't even do that right, apparently. Everybody's just waiting for the enormous shrew. I'm gonna do what this person's doing. I'm just gonna run around like a maniac. Just run around in circles, man. Running around in circles, eh? My guess is the enormous shrew is gonna pop up over here somewhere. Come on, don't keep us waiting now. Oh, it'll be over here. Good job, good job, person. I can summon you over here, I have horns. I have some close to completing the 12 day wrapper. Oh, okay, sure. What do you you wanna send me a summon now, Lushire? I'll take it. Uh, well, we didn't get the enormous, but it's okay. It's not like I need need it. It doesn't even count towards a shrew stomp, which is upsetting. All right, 17 rounds to go, eh? 17 rounds of shrews to stomp. Do How many cosmetic pets are we on? I was going through like a cosmetic pet rabbit hole. 62? I think that's okay. That's not bad. We got crawlers. We got the wormling, which we had. Oh, we got the mole rat. Ugh. We got gross cosmetic pets. That's what we got. Do -do. Do -do. Ba -ba um. Sorry, just got a text from my bestie. Making sure she A-OK. -okay. Thank you for the horn. I appreciate it, Lost Shire Hobbit. I appreciate it. Yeah, I don't even know what to do, like, after the Spring Festival. Like, what does one do in Lotro without a festival? Do we just, uh... Mm -mm. Oh, you were in the maze? You didn't want to summon me? That's fair. Um, like, what does one do after the festival? I guess we just go to Gundabad. 
Do do. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Big bows. Big bows. Ooh. All right. Uh, let me get my uh. Oh, I saw the bow. I'm sorry. I ran away. Let me go to Sergeant Tom. Lamarina, you say sleep. <laughs> that's fair, honestly. Maybe that's what's going on. I'm lacking sleep. And it must be because I'm just playing the fest too much, huh? Strong beer is that person's Would name. I can't. All right, there's quite a few people here, though. That's good news. Good, good news. Um... Scott, you said be festive, but how can you be festive if there's no festival? Would you do it just doesn't make me? any sense. Irina, eat bacon, dance at concerts, mock <laughs> WC troll. Yeah, that's true. I mean, I don't do that. I don't mock the I don't mock the world chat trolls, but they deserve to be mocked every now and again. <laughs> I didn't say that though. Um, but yeah, I mean, yeah, I guess there are concerts. That is true. Wait, we should do the fence, guys! Oh, we should totally do the Brock and Boring's fences. Ooh. Love doing that. We have a lot of shrews to stomp. Ooh, I feel overwhelmed. It's okay, we still got like, what, two, three days? Honestly, I think there's three days I have planned to do of Spring Fest still. Yeah, yeah, after today. It should be Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Friday, Saturday, and Sunday for the four days, yeah? Well, this will be day one. What can I do for Friday, you? Saturday, Sunday. Yeah, I have to do it on Sunday. Oof. I still don't know what time I'm streaming on Sunday because my my family and I might have plans. Um, Because normally my granny really likes to celebrate Easter and we just do like a big dinner. But um, I don't know if we're totally doing that because it sounds like... Because there's a family friend of ours who's coming up. Um, so yeah, yeah, Saturday stream. I don't know what time I'll be streaming yet because I do have a family friend. Ooh, wrong table. Do have a family friend, my godmother, she's going to be in town. Um, and she's trying to make plans to see me and I want to see her. So stream on Saturday might be a little later. <laughs> large shrew or buzz? I guess so. Man, I need the large shrew. But I haven't gotten it yet. RD Maximilian, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the Rear Community. I hope you're having a good day. Watch our switches off 3 a.m. Eastern on the 2nd. Yeah. Oh, 3 a.m. Eastern on the 2nd. Okay, so I'd still have that Monday. Even though I don't stream on Mondays. But if we had to catch up, that's a chance to. Do, do, do. It's okay. We got time. I know I I know I scheduled this correctly. I know I did it. I know I did it right. I just got to trust the process, you know? Uh, wow, I have 84 spring leaves. Ooh! Look at me go. Um, alright. Well, I did the wine. I did the horse race. I should probably go back to Dweeland, yeah? Probably stomping some shrews already. Honestly, it probably already started. Probably missed it. Chickens are running through the hedge maze! Wait, really? I might need that. I might need those. Um, I don't know. Let's go see if shrews be stomping. I feel like we might have been too late, but it's okay. Yeah, like, um... I guess we'll just have to keep working on going to Gundabad and getting through to the Vales and stuff. Level 120. Oi! How do you do? Do 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 do. We could just go to Brockenborns right now too if the Shrew Stomp's going on, because the fences are gonna take some freaking time, guys. It's gonna be wild. Wild. Uh, uh, uh. Um. <gasps> Yay! It hasn't started yet. Oh, we're lucky. We're so lucky. Mind my words. Okay. Brother. I don't know how long I've got, but I have a feeling I don't have long. Stay a moment. Wow! I'm actually shocked. I made it in time. I'm actually shocked by this. Wow, no one's on right now. I feel so like, uh... 
I don't know. It's so weird not to have friends on. <laughs> I feel like every single night I've run into like a frick ton of people. And so uh, now that I look at my friends list, I'm like, nobody's playing Lotro. Oh, Bort, Bort, you're playing Lotro. Oh, you're in Lindably. Ooh. Snorgar, you said I normally do the Springfest quest before going to sleep, but today I did it earlier and it just feels really weird right now. Oh, I bet. Yeah. A thousand and ten percent. It feel weird to me as well. I'd be like, what? Now I can do the quest over here, though. And not have any issues. Do -do. What is this person? Oh, they're a champion. I was like, what? What is that? By the way, I made my first choice in the great company storyline. I feel like I made a mistake. Wait, what'd you do? What'd you do, Snorgar? I can give you a hint of whether or not it was a bad thing or a good thing. Honestly, it kind of depends on what you want. What we'll see in two years, I guess. <laughs> pretty much, pretty much, man. That's how it works. It's like, bro. We'll see when do we get there, I guess. Which could take forever, you know? Do Look at all these shrews and he's stomping. Wait, why does it only count for eight? Wait, something's not counting here. Hold on. I just saw ten of these dudes. Why I only get eight? Ah, uh, okay. Well, something's not counting. Okay, so this might be more than 17 rounds now. Okay, so I had to choose who I wanted to travel with to Dunland. I hate that it is a choice. Oh, I don't know what, um... I don't know if that's a bad thing or a good, like... I don't know. <laughs> that was so incredibly unfortunate for that person! <laughs> like, out of all the places that Shrew could have started up on, it started right on top of that girly. Aw, <laughs> oh, I feel so bad, yo. What the heck? What Hey, Mai! How's it going? Hello, hello! Aside with Sloth, thank you so much for the follow. Why Welcome to the weird community. I hope you're having a good day. Will you lend me your ear? Well, I guess I'll go do these real quick while I wait for the next one. I'm actually really upset that my other shrews aren't counting. Something's really off here. I'm not okay with this. Lossie said I got the B team through earlier, so working on the A team now. Ooh. Um, you feel like you made a mistake with you. it? Well, who did you ask to travel with you? I, I, honestly, Sargar, I think that choice doesn't really matter too much. It just matters how... I don't want to say too much, but... it. I don't think that choice matters too much, I'll just say. Maya said, saw your wordy video earlier. Hobbit wordy is a way to go. You have the racial fan skill. Helps a lot. And if you have hammer or axe, it looks so small. <laughs> love it. Heck yeah. Yeah, I mean, I love my Hobbit wordy. So, is she so cute? She's a little cutie patootie. Yeah, I didn't even think about the, the faint skill for Hobbits, dude. That could be so helpful, and I always forget about it. Maya said, I'm good, thank you. For, um, you've been sick lately. Barely was at PC. Miss your walk to Mordor. No! Dang, Maya, I'm sorry. I hope that you feel better. Stunning Steve, you say Aubrey! Stunning Steve! How's it going? <laughs> okay, that makes me happy about it, yeah. Yeah, that choice doesn't matter too much. It, it really goes down to who you ask to, like, because you have options of which rangers you want to take and then others who will ask if they can stay and that's kind of like kind of important uh sending steve i'm good did you see what i sent you on discord oh frick i haven't watched it yet i i know you did i saw it and i haven't watched it i'm sorry i saw it i didn't i didn't i, I didn't look at it i'm sorry i'll watch it later Sorgar, I'm really interested in the storyline, but the choice system thing you talked about really has me stressed about any choice. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said anything. 
But I just was really upset when I didn't realize that there was a choice system. Like, the game did not make it clear. Like, normally the game would be, like, you know, in, like, bold red on the quest line. They'd be like, this, d the, this choice will affect the outcome later in, you know, blah, blah, blah story. Normally they're pretty upfront about it, but nah. Dude, this volume quest, they were like, frick that. You're gonna make choices and you won't even realize it will affect anything because I didn't even know until people in the chat were telling me like, oh, well, this wouldn't have happened if like you Would instead you had like, me? you make this choice. And I'm just like, what? Um, You're all good. I am in no hurry. Okay, okay, sweet, sweet, Sunny Steve. But how you doing, man? How can I How's it service? going? How are you? Boop. 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 So many things to just boop. How do you do? Uh, do I lend, please? Um. Starcar, you said, uh, I hope the choices don't matter too much because it doesn't matter what I do. I'm gonna think I made a bad choice. When I have to make a choice, should I look it up on the internet? Don't look it up. Don't look it up. Just play it as you will because honestly, like... It's just like, okay, Lotro's just like Swotor with the choices is that even if you decide to do something, like the outcome will still be the same no matter what for certain people. It just depends on how soon or how long it might take for them to get to that output or that outcome. That's kind of what your choices will affect. So I'm like, I'm like, I'm really upset, man, because I done messed up real bad on someone and I it, like it still would have blown up in their face. I'm learning, but like it would have just blown up a lot later and probably in a kinder fashion than what I had happened. Why you said yes, I'm way better. I uh, can game finally have to see you. I hope you're all doing well the world too. Yeah, heck yeah, my heck yeah, man. I've been playing some warden. I've been really wanting to do some videos lately. I've been trying to write some articles in hopes of like having like some sort of like blog or website for you guys on Lord of the Rings tutorials and stuff because I feel like doing the videos takes so much time. So I'm hoping that I can have like a written guide and stuff, which I feel like that would just be easier for me to keep up with. So we'll see. I got the merch is coming in, guys. I, 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 it's, it's shipped. It's coming to my place. I'm gonna take pictures. I'm excited about it. Um, new YouTube video will probably get announced next month or this upcoming month, April. Uh, so I have to edit some videos for that. So yeah. Okay, noted. Yeah, I hope I'm not smiling too much, Snorgar. Um, hey, Jaden, how's it going? You gave me a way to hydrate. Thank you. Uh, do. Thank you for that. Um, yeah, how you doing today, Jaden? Uh, Stunning Steamy said, I'm awesome. Just remember when you watch it, I am non-PG. Okay, no worries. <laughs> no worries, man. I, um, you know, I'm actually shocked how, like, uh, PG I, I try to be. Like, I don't think we're that PG, guys. Like, I would say we're a good PG-13. Yeah? Would you guys agree PG-13? I mean, we talk a lot about feet. Which could be innocent, but it's like, nah, nah, you, yeah, nah. Um, so yeah, I think we're PG thirteen. <laughs> so I'm actually I'm I'm shocked by that because I used to be like a sailor. I used to be terrible. I'd be like, yo, just uh, oh, how how effing dare these effing shrews, you know? <laughs> I don't know what changed, man. I don't know what changed. Level 16 hunter. Oh, they're changing their uh their frame. Uh I don't try to be something I am not. I'm definitely a hard R. <laughs> That's fair, man. I mean, yeah. Uh kind of some of these character names I'm finding in Lotro, I'm just like Big head scratch, just big head scratches. Stomp some shrews while we plant some seeds. Dude. 
There's so many shrews. Like, how are we on such a weird number of shrew stops? I don't understand. Yeah, like, now we're on eight. 248. I... Snorgari said, no, uh, not at all. In fact, I'm happy you told me because it prepares me for what's to come. I always try to censor myself when I'm near younger people, but other than that, I curse to everything, yeah. See, I was so bad at, at a time because I was just like... I was totally under the impression around younger people. I was like, if y'all don't want me to curse, you just don't bring your kids around me. That's exactly like I was such a douchebag. <laughs> people would be like, yo, chill, Aubrey, chill. And I'd be like, mm, you don't have to bring your kids near me. It's a, <laughs> that's a choice, you know? <laughs> like, oh my gosh, I was such a douchebag. <laughs> Hey, Saber, how's it going? How you doing today? <laughs> oh, I talk like a sailor, What's you say, you Steve? Oh, heck yeah, man. We've all been there. Yeah, I used to say when I was younger, I'd always be like, oh, frick. Oh, shoot. You know, I always had the replacement words. And then it was like, as soon as I was about to be 18, my mom was like, uh, you're about to be an adult. You're allowed to curse as long as it's not at me. And then I was just like, great. Well, that was just so fudging crazy. <laughs> uh, Sarhead, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the weird community. I hope you're having a good day today. Uh, Saber, dealing with life and sucking at it. Oh, man. Join the club, Saber. I'm with you. I feel like uh, I'm shocked. It's literally about to be April. Like, where has the time gone? I'm actually- it's actually making me really bummed. A lot of- gosh, yo, my family, bro, everybody has some sort of medical issues this year. And bro, this month in particular, everybody's just dropping like flies, bro. They got like- they, they're just having the craziest of problems. And then it's all these big cancer scares, and I'm just like, yo, I can't deal. Sentence enhancement, exactly. <laughs> Sentence enhancement unlocked. The new generation has already begun saying words at an even earlier age. Just absolutely insane. Words that they likely don't even understand. This is true. If I were, I will not lie, I was definitely that kid where I would probably be jamming to wa WAP not knowing what WAP stands for. I mean, my mom, gosh, I, I like, so Britney Spears, you know. She had her infamous, uh, If He Seek Amy song. Yeah, your girl was jamming to it at a young age, and my mom was like, P.O'd, bro. Dude, I remember my mom, she was like in her lap, like in her room on the laptop, and she just kept rewinding it, and rewinding it, and rewinding it, because she was trying to listen for it, and I didn't know, like, what the bad thing about the song was, and that, and then it was like, when I got older and I looked it up, I was like, Oh, okay. Um, ooh. Uh, yeah. Um, good call, mom. Good call. Steve, I'm very good about censoring myself in certain circumstances. I own a greenhouse, so when I have customers, I don't swear. You know what's crazy about that? I got something to say to comment on that, by the way. Um, you said when I am around elders or Amish, I don't swear. When I'm in normal circumstances or on stream, I drop 10 F-bombs a minute. <laughs> yeah, what the heck, man? Yeah, that's the craziest thing, though. I feel like so many people in the workplaces, they cuss so much lately. Like, I think... Oh my gosh, like, at my office job, I hated cussing. Like, if, I always felt, like, very odd if I was cussing. And, like, that's how you knew I had a bad day. It was, like, if I dropped a word. Because it was, like, so rare anyone would cuss. And then it was, like, I go to this cake decorating job. You know, like, no one cares, bro. My boss is just, like, F this. This crap. This. And, you know, and everybody's just, like, just dropping them. And I'm just, like, I don't think this is the place to drop it right now. Okay? Like, chill. <laughs> Uh, Snorgar, you said, like, you don't have Fortnite to play or something. <laughs> Yo, who plays Fortnite anymore? That's what the real question. Oh, wait, let me go out and, uh, turn this stuff in real quick. The older I get, the more lyrics I understand. I hate it. And I'm not even old. That's the worst part. I know, right, man? I'm... 
I do I don't like it. It's like the more I rewatch stuff, the more I see things just like I'm just so disappointed that I missed them when I was younger, but then it Major just makes me him. sad because I'm like, I just can't look at this the same, you know? Like SpongeBob SquarePants is forever screwed for me now. I can't watch SpongeBob and take it anywhere seriously. And I remember my mom because when my mom told her that a friend told her about Spongebob being inappropriate and my mom was like, what's bad about Spongebob? And then they were just like, let's go over the character names for you. <laughs> They're living in a bikini bottom for starters. <laughs> There's sandy cheeks and oh my God, Mr. Krabs. <laughs> I'm like, oof. She is not rock, you know? <laughs> she's, um, she's on to something, I guess. I don't think of it like that, but... Um, SpongeBob doesn't have hair, or does he? I'm, uh... I'm convinced. Uh, how old is Snorgar? Ooh. Uh, RD Maximilian, you said the only time I curse is while I'm watching or participating in a competitive activity. Yes. When it is competitive, Y'all will hear me drop them on- You guys will hear me drop them. Like hell, I've been dropping them on the fence lately. I I get so PO'd about the fences and the Shire and... I'll just be like... Ah! You know? <laughs> Fortunately, pretty much everything in life is a competitive activity. Ooh. Yeah, I get that way with uh, the Battlefront tournaments. I do curse often a lot more, I've noticed. And it's because I take it so competitive. Like, I'm just so extreme sometimes. Uh, and the rest of the guys are amped up too. So it's like, ooh, it's a tough one. Dead by Daylight, same thing. I get scared and I curse. It happens. <laughs> What's wrong with Squidward? I don't think he was the problem. But I can tell you, Saber. I don't think he was bad. There was something about Squidward that he would do that made it kind of inappropriate, like an induendo, but I couldn't I couldn't tell you right now. I can't remember. There's something with Plankton as well, but I can't. The whole panty raid episode. <laughs> Bro, there's so many episodes. I look back like what? Like when my mom let me watch my Carly. Gosh, she would talk so much crap about Hannah Montana. Oh, Hannah Montana is bad. I don't want you watching that. Oh, sweet life on deck with Cody. I want you watching that. You can tell I'm exposing how young I am here. But man, I was allowed to watch SpongeBob, no problem. iCarly, bro, I watch iCarly. I'm like, how did we how did we not see everything that is coming out about these shows? Like it was written on the walls. Oh, iCarly's okay, Aubrey. Meanwhile, they just have like a floating bra that they talk to. I'm like, yep, yeah, that's something young kids should, you know, see. Lots of feet. Lots of feet. Lots of feet. Um, Snorgar would rather not say, that's fair. Keep it, do, my boss asked me today, she asked me how old I was because she was referencing an old song. And everyone around her was too young to understand. And then she asked me how old I was and I was like, I feel kind of uncomfortable saying how old I am because I'm a lot younger than these people who don't understand this song. But she's kind of assuming I'm older. <laughs> So it was like kind of nice to live in that like bubble where she didn't know my age But then I, I told her and I was like I'm 22 and she was just like, oh, yeah, you certainly don't know <laughs> And I was like Ooh. Like she was talking about ghosts. She was talking about the movie ghost and nobody knew about the movie Because everyone was too young to have seen it when it came out and I was like, okay I was too young to I wasn't even around when it came out. Okay, but like I know the movie. I like the movie. It's a good movie. Like snake hiding legs. <laughs> Snorgar, I know that sounds sus, but I'd rather just not say- Oh no, you're totally fine, Snorgar. I don't think it's sus. Snorgar is like, I'm just- I'm just, uh, younger than you think. And I does not say- Uh, when I was younger, I didn't mind sharing it, but not, not all people need to know how old I am. No, that's totally fair. I get it, I get it. It's like sometimes when you say how old you are, people judge. Oh, uh, Valen, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the weird community. I hope you're having a good day. Get freaking thrown across that round match room, what whatever. 
<laughs> those shows were freaking great though zach and cody How best stuff ever i did not like zach and cody even when i would sneak and watch it i never got the thing phineas and ferb i never liked i don't know what it was about zach and cody sweet life on deck and phineas and ferb i never liked those and everybody loved those no worries i'll find pardon me for asking oh it's okay my i mean i mean you did say like if you're comfortable so i think you're totally fine <laughs> Snorgar, you said no, no, not so for young. I just don't want people to think there's some guy in his 50s or something. Oh my gosh, you're totally fine. Pretty common among Lotra players. I was gonna say, Snorgar, I was like, honestly, if that's the case, like, not a biggie. <laughs> because that's most people that watch my videos. I don't know why. I was talking to my mom's boyfriend. And I told him because I, uh, so I asked him to basically take a picture in the merch. Because I was like, you know, people uh, who watch me are around his age. He's like, um, um, mid forties. And, um, and you know, uh, most of the people here are males, you know, I'm female. So like, yeah. And I was just like, I just need someone who is going to most represent like the people that watch, I guess, just so that you guys have a better like idea of what the merch would look like on you, like a, a man of like your build, I guess, similar um instead of like you know me like of course i'll have pictures with me in the merch but you know whatever um but yeah and he was just like don't you think that's weird and i was like what and he was just like that people who are like twice as older as you who are the opposite gender watch you and i was just like no <laughs> like I don't think he realizes that that's pretty common for this game. <laughs> I'm like, dude, I'm the outlier, okay? That's what's that's what's weird. That's what makes me weird. I'm the outlier here, okay? <laughs> most, uh, you know, most people my age are still playing Fortnite, like we were talking about earlier. I don't, uh, I don't play Fortnite or League. League, oh my gosh, so much League. Valorant, I feel like it's slowly creeping up. Which is funny, because I prefer Valorant over any of the most popular games lately. Um, <laughs> Anna Mannix. Same where you said Squidward was the main hero. He's just trying to live life in Spongebob. It's just annoying him, bro. Squidward, eh. It's so funny, because Squidward's such a crab apple. And we used to give him so much crap. But man, I relate to Squidward so much, man. I relate to him so much now. Uh, Maya said, when I started to play Lotra, there were folks in my guild in their 60s, and my leader was 71 years old. I was 27, felt like the baby. Dude, that's how I felt with my family, bro. My grandma is up here playing Lotra. She's in her 70s. She's still rocking Lotro. I mean, very rarely now, but, you know, my dad, my dad, wow, my... My dad is getting to his 50s. Ooh. That hit me, bro. My parents are... Oh. I don't know why, but my parents hitting 50, that kind of, like... That just... I don't know. That just hits me like something else. I'm like, wow, we are all getting older. It's just going by so quickly. Batter, hey! Hello, Aubrey and Chow. I hope you're doing well. I wanted to ask, what's the best professions for a solo run with champion class with heroic plus two difficulty? Um, best professions for a solo run, champion, um, definitely go prospector and the armorer professions for sure. Um, last profession though? I think I'm going to go and I'm going to tell you to do a Tinker. I think if you do Prospector, Tinker, and the Armsman. Or, I'm sorry, not the Armsman. Sorry, the exact opposite. The Armorsmith one. The Metalsmith, that's what it's called. So, yeah, I'll repeat. <laughs> prospector, Metalsmith, and Tinker. That's what I would suggest because jewelry, I feel like people forget about. I am one of those people. I always forget about it. Very helpful on Heroic Plus 2 difficulty, especially if you're starting in your earlier levels. Armsman could be okay, which is like crafting weapons, but I wouldn't recommend because once you get your legendary item, there's really like, that's a profession you'll probably just want to throw out eventually. So if you stick with Tinker, I think that would be helpful. And then, yeah, Metalsmith, you can make armor and you need good gear, especially on Heroic Plus 2 difficulty. It's tough. Need that Might gear, man. Um, 
sketchy so movies and tv shows have varying age gender audiences that's just the way entertainment goes true Mind golly words, um steve you said i was a battle royale streamer for five years started on fortnite went to uh h1z never heard of it i'm pubg console pubg yep realm royale man i just heard about that the other day i saw someone i think it was uh baggins tv i was checking out baggins tv's youtube channel and i think he did like a lot of realm royale and i was like what the heck is this um <laughs> uh, warzone utc you know what's funny i feel like i would be someone who would play a lot more uh counter-strike i don't mind counter-strike but i feel like counter-strike is just such a a, a very intense uh, dominated field so i i try to avoid but i i thoroughly enjoy playing um csgo when that was like really a uh, time hey i'm uh, uh, mj dog how you doing um Sargar, I liked Valorant, but stopped playing it. I despise the anti-cheat. Dude, Sargar, I don't know why. I can't play Valorant. I don't know what happened. Ever since I got this PC, I could never play Valorant. I actually did try to reinstall it recently, so wish me luck. But I think the anti-cheat is causing me to not be able to play it for whatever reason. And I don't understand why. I'm not cheating, I swear. I have no reason to cheat. I have nothing to prove. Big hug for Grandma. Thanks, bye. I'll let her know. Uh, Snorgar, you said, don't do Weaponsmith or the one that involves weapons. I just got the legendary item and I have no use for it. Correct. Do not do the Weaponsmith one if you can avoid it. Great MMO. Hello. Is it worth it to buy the IP one time only? Correct. It is worth it. You will get, um, like your swift travels on any characters that are, that are active during the VIP. You'll get more inventory slots available after you get one time a VIP. Uh, you also, yeah, inventory slots and character slots, I should say. Um, so there, there are just some perks that are nice about having VIP one time, and it can certainly help you and save you some time or even space. Uh, Batter TV said, wait, I never heard about Tinker. Uh, I'm such a noob. <laughs> okay, got it. Thank you. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, Tinker is basically like a jeweler. Um, so it's, it's very helpful. It will definitely help you with the gear and stuff. Uh, can you change professions while keeping the progress? Uh, no, I don't think you can, Snorgar. I think you'll lose your progress as soon as you change. Uh, and you start from square one again if you, like, want to go back to it. I'm pretty sure that's how it works, but I couldn't be too sure. Um, as far as prospect uh, prospector, I can't use it for anything worthwhile. No, yeah, I don't think you can, like, bring it back up. Uh... Dude, the grandparents I live with are both 80 this year. Lost Shire Hobbit, they were 57 when they took me in. Wow. Like, that's crazy. My my granny, who's basically raised me, she... Gosh, I was four when I lived with her. And how old would she have been? I think she was, like, late 50s. And now my granny is, like, in her early 70s, yo. I, I'm sorry, in her early 70s? In her mid 70s? I can't remember. It, it's flying by too fast now, okay? It's just flying by too fast. I don't know anymore. I didn't realize I still had soil to knock over here. Hold on, I feel like. Wait, I could stomp on your. <gasps> No one told me that! Wait, I just totally found a hack to get through the shrew stomps! Uh, what? Hold on, hold on. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys. So basically, I didn't do- I didn't plant the seeds, and I still had access to stomp on the boots on the shrews, even though I had passed the shrews. But because I hadn't planted all the seeds, I didn't- it was it it was like I could still sh stomp on him. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, because you could see I'm one. I'm I'm at two hundred sixty nine now. So I gained one. I stomped on eleven of them that time. Hold on, on, hold on. I am on to something, y'all. Okay, we're gonna have to wait. I'll show you guys. Um, M MJ Dog, I'm so sorry. It took me forever to get to your chats. Um, finally catching a lovely off of the weird one. Hi, Kitty Vituity. <laughs> Hi. Uh, do we have the same glasses? I don't know. Do we? 
Should I, uh... Do they look the same? Okay, my glasses, though, um, I didn't know when I got them. They're, like, um, they were, like, uh, I guess, like, some sort of, like, uh, Christian, like, religion type of glass, because I have, like, these, like, colors, I guess, which is why I picked it up, because it's not that noticeable, but I have, like, some colors. It's, it looks like, 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 window, like, glass paint or whatever, and then... I looked and there was like crosses and stuff like at the back of my <laughs> glasses and I was like wait I got like kind of religious looking glasses I guess and it, I don't know what they were but I was like okay oh, oh thanks FJ dog how you doing today how your streams been girl a saver saver you said I stopped playing um FPS games a long time ago honestly I really don't play them often now i mean with the exception of battlefront but i i don't really even play battlefront anymore uh stunning steve you said i enjoy uh overwatch too also but i hate playing solo yeah i've tried i never played overwatch i've tried to get into streams of it and i just, i've just felt like it's way too much oh ace thank you so much for 100 bitties how are you doing heck yeah uh, MJ Dog, I've changed, and you lose all process and recipes learned. Yeah, dang. Yep, that's what I figured. Uh, Sorgar, you said, womp, womp, womp. There will be no crafting for me, but that's not entirely a problem. Yeah, that's not too bad. You don't really need to craft in Lotra. I just think it's a lot of fun to craft, I guess. Uh, Batter TV said, oh yeah, I forgot to ask, which server are you playing? Is it good for new players? Um, I play on Crick Hollow. It's one of the lesser populated servers, uh, so um, I guess for new players, maybe not. If you wanted something in the middle of the road, definitely could go with like Brandywine or Gladden. Those would probably be better for you. Uh, Batter TV, if you do need some more suggestions or just more information on the servers, I do have a video for you to check out um, that I will share with you right now. Once I pull it up, you know, you know. But yeah, thank you for those biddies, Ace. That means a lot, man. Thank you for the support. All right, so yeah, if you want to check it out, here's a server video on Lotro. Um, if you need that, that'll provide you with more info. <laughs> My bless your grand, your granda. My grandma, yeah. Thank you uh mj dog you said i'm doing great i'm having a wonderful week i'm so thrilled to be making new friends from this game i'm have i'm so happy to be playing heck yeah let's go yeah i'm so happy for you because it's a lot of fun i mean lost shire hobby here you know we're fellowed up right now uh they seem like they they're pretty i want to say you're that new to the game but definitely new to having i guess friends in the game like it sounds like like, I'm someone who very much solos a lot, and it sounds like Glashire Hop is kind of the same in that regard, and I feel like everybody's just kind of, like, in this big friends, like, frenzy phase in Lotro, I guess, where everybody's friending each other. It's a big happy family. Uh, how are you doing? I'm doing alright, can't complain. I worked, uh, so I work at, like, a bakery, basically, but I just frost cakes, that's all I do, and, uh, Man, it was before Easter, and they say it gets busy, and I witnessed it today. I was frosting so many cakes, yo, so many cakes. I couldn't even tell you. I frosted my life away. And you know what? I actually really like having a job that keeps me so busy. Batter TV, you said, noise, thank you. Yep. Grandma, yeah, for raising you. Miss M there. Sorry. No, you're good, Ma. You're good. Just making sure I got it. Um... Yeah, yeah, my granny. See, okay, so um, I guess I should specify this. I have a, I have a granny and a grandma, and my granny is the one who raised me, um, and she's my, she's my mom's mom, and my grandma is my dad's mom, and I haven't seen her too too long. Are you switching characters? I'm assuming. Yep, you're switching. All right, let me know, Lushire. Uh, yes, I met Sally, and then I met Aubrey and everyone else. Yeah. Now she's stuck with us. You can't leave us, La Sha Hobbit. You can't. Uh, Weird Hydrate, thank you, Gadget. Whew. 
thank you, thank you. Play very old games, lol. Republic Commando, for example. That's actually a good game. Heck yeah, Saber. I still need to buy it. That's one. One of those I still need to buy. I am slacking. Uh, MJ Doggy said, so also got really great news yesterday, so I'm doing a little solo celebration. Heck yeah. Oh, wait, what's the news? If you don't mind sharing. Um, Emmy also said, what an amazing community. Okay, I'm totes... No, I'm totes new to the game. Oh, you are. You're like totally, totally new. Really? I'm shocked by that. I feel like, like, I thought I saw you playing with, um, tweet my hashtag the other day. And I was like, oh, okay. They must be like friends or something. And like, they've probably played for a while. I just kind of assumed. Um, so that's, that's wild. Ace, you said cakes. I want one, bro. Me too. I don't even think I get a discount on cake. I'm actually upset. I'm like, bro, I'll just go to a different cake place. It's cheaper. Uh, and you said, I only just got my first gaming PC like last week. Wait, really? Wow! Dude, congrats. That's always, that's always, that is always a freaking blast, okay? Having your, for, your first gaming PC, it's awesome. Dang, gosh, I have a 100 brawler. Oh, I need a brawler at 100. Yeah. I do want a brawler alt next. Okay, so here's the here's the trick I'm learning. Don't do all the soil. I think that's what the plan is here. I think you stop as many shrews, but make sure you get to the, the soil, obviously, within the time limit. So I guess I'll do like three, and then I'll just start stomping on every shrew, and then I'll, I'll see like how much, how many I can stomp on, like if it's past 10 or not. Um, or the week before, I haven't had the ability to play till now. Wow, and that's crazy. Well, I'm glad you can. Welcome to Lotro. Okay, so we're at we're at four shrews. All right, this is for science. This is for science. My shrew. My shrew. Okay, we're at six total. I guess I'll work on a soil as they respawn. Do... All right, I will catch up on chats in a second. I need to. I'm in. I'm in science mode right now, experimentation mode. Okay, we're at eight shrews, nine, ten. See, ten, and it's still not eleven. Twelve. A thirteen. Look at it, it's counting. Fourteen. <gasps> Fifteen. 16? Yo! If you would have told me this, we could have saved so much time! I didn't know that you could do it like this! Oh! I almost got kicked out. Ooh, I got him! Hee hee hee. I almost got kicked out of the arena! That was really bad. Look at that! We're almost at 300 now. Okay, we still got a minute. I think the soils take about like 20 seconds, I'd say. Maybe 30. I won't risk it. Like, look at this. We're gonna get to 300 easy. Wow, this, is, this saves so much time, y'all. So much time. Oh my golly. All right, I don't know if more are gonna respawn. I'll grab a soil. Oh. Wow, 302. Y'all, this is gonna be so quick now. I'm what so excited. Mean? That doesn't, that means that we don't have to do 18 rounds of shrews. Not, wow, I wish I knew Make this like 400 shrews ago. Wow, wow. Anyway, sorry, I'm just blown away by this. I'm learning. Okay, well, if you guys need to do the deed, there's a hack for you, I guess. Uh, like our hobby said, honestly, I don't want to lose my new friends. <laughs> you don't have to worry about it. Uh, oh, you say Ellie, Ellie and Rose is Cicero's younger sister. Aww. That's cute. They have backstories. Uh, MJ Dog, he said, yes, he's a friend of mine. They wanted me to play so bad, but I couldn't tell them. Oh, sweet. Oh, that's so cool. 
Uh, I've had a Mac as my PC till now. I was switching. Oh, you were gaming on your Switch and Xbox, which is honestly still pretty new to me. Switch in 2021, Xbox in 2022. Wow. You seem like a new gamer then, I'd say, M. Like a relatively newer gamer. Like three... Three years old of a gamer. Maya said, night, have fun. See you. Thanks, Maya, for being here. I hope you are, you know, doing better from being sick and all that. So, um, thanks for being here, Maya. Have a good night. Uh, thank you. I'm so happy to have met you. Aw, I'm happy to have met you too, Eb. Hey, Dan. Hey, hey, how you doing? Hey, we're doing well. I just found out a, uh, a trick to get my shrew deed done quicker. And I'm ecstatic about it, Dan. I'm ecstatic. Uh, and you said I am? Nice! Well, that's exciting. It, gaming is so much fun. I love it. It can be so overwhelming. I have never played on a Switch. Consoles are really not my go-to. Like, I haven't played on PlayStation, Xbox. Um, I, I, I guess I, I played on a, play, a PlayStation. God, my dad had a PlayStation 2 when I was, like, 6. And that was like the only thing that I used to play because he was always on the computer and he never wanted to take, you know, put me on the computer because he was always on the computer and he was like, no, I want the computer. You can have the PlayStation. So I do miss the PlayStation 2 days, man. PS2, there were some good games on there, man. But uh, yeah, other than that, I don't really console much. So I don't know how I really got into it. Like, I don't know what gravitated me towards PC gaming, I guess. My dad, probably. Um, Dan, you said you did shareable? Yeah, yeah. Here, I'll show you. So, um, what I did, this is the, this is the trick. When you do the Elite Gardener quest, you have to do the soil and you have to hit your 10 shrews. Well, I learned that if you, the problem is if you hit the 10 shrews, then your boots will be like red out like how they are right now. And I can't stomp on any other shrews. But if you don't finish the soil, you can go past the 10 limit of shrews and it'll count towards your deed. So don't fill up all the soils immediately. Do like three or four within the time limit and then leave the last one. And then you'll have like a whole two minutes to stomp as many shrews as possible. So I literally, I think I stomped like over 20 shrews that time. It was crazy. So my deed, my deed's gonna be a flyby now. It's gonna be so easy. Uh, and you said I was never allowed to have the real gaming systems when I was growing up. Oh, Stay a moment. Uh, I had like an OG Nintendo Game Boy and the, uh, the Sega Game Gear, heck yeah. Oh man. But when the cool systems started coming out, I was not allowed to have them, aw. Yeah, that was, that was something, you know, kind of going into that. My mom watched this video yesterday and it was about like how parents are are kind of like conditioned to um like have their like uh, girls like their little girls like not really put them in like STEM related stuff and my mom like apologized to me about it and I was just so confused cuz I was just like I mean it's fine and she was like no like I was just conditioned to almost treat you like this girly girl so I never exposed you to other things like that and then I was like well honestly me personally stem's not really like my go-to I guess it's something it's really not something I've really explored uh but it just never really like excited me I guess but I was like in a way I was like but ma like yeah because she never really approved of me gaming she still kind of doesn't but at least she accepts it a lot more but man, she would she did not like me gaming at a young age. So I kind of get that to some extent. Uh, Alicia, you said I've been gaming for years on the ordinary HP laptop and only now found out I was supposed to have a better PC. Do Alicia, me too. I think I'm my first gaming PC. Gosh, I've been playing on a PC and gaming on a PC since I was six years old, okay? Playing Lotro, all that fun jazz. Mind you, I did not get my first actual gaming PC until 2019 when COVID or, or it was like right before COVID or it was COVID. It was either 2019, 2020. Whenever I started streaming, pretty much, I like had a gaming PC for like a year before. Yeah. So like I'm 
I don't know how I did it. I, I was pretty much, I had like an ordinary like HP desktop. It was like an office desktop. My granny had it. She put viruses on it. She didn't want it. She gave it to me. I got all the viruses off pretty much. And then I was like, well, I can game on this now. And then, yeah, um, my dad like jammed a graphics card into it and it ran. <laughs> I was so shocked. Uh, Emmy said, oh, dang, ah, the worries. Finally living out my gaming dreams. Heck yeah, let's go. Gadget, you said I have a 360 in a closet somewhere. I don't miss consoles at all. Man, I did have a DS when I was younger. I had a DS and a DSi. We had a Wii. Um, but other than that, that was it. My dad had the PlayStation 2, but my dad lived far away, so I never I never played with it. Uh, only the one summer, actually, because then he had to sell it. Um, recently, like whenever the next summer was that I saw him, so... Yeah, so here, I'm gonna show you the the thing, Dan. So here, I'm stomping... How many shrews am I at? I'm at four shrews total. I'm gonna work on soil now, uh, just because other people are stomping and we gotta wait. Um, but I'm gonna probably hit over the 10 in the next round of shrews when they respawn in. And I'll show you what I mean. Here, I'll work on a shrew now. Come here, come here, precious! Come here, my precious! Oh. Man, tagged one so far away. Yeah, so we're at eight now. Nine. All right, 10 shrews. Look at that, 10 shrews and the boots aren't limited. It's because I haven't finished the soil. That's the trick. So I'll show you, see, 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 11. 12. 13, and they're all counting to my deed. My deed's up here, 316 now. Gosh, we're at 14. Wait, Punky Spy? Oh, wait, I thought it said Punky. I was like, Punky Brewster, I love Punky Brewster. Yeah, so I'll do this soil. But yeah, when I do the next soil, then I'm, I'm done done. But I'm still stomping shrews, yo. Look at that. Getting that deed done, man. Oh, come here, my precious. Yeah, because the enormous shrew, unfortunately, doesn't count towards the Taming of the Shrews deed, which is kind of baloney, if you ask me. Oh, I got it! Let's go! Ooh. Thank you so much, uh, Lassant, for the follow. Welcome to the weird community. I hope you're having a good day. Yeah, so I'm pretty much gonna do this until we're at like 25 seconds or so. Man, everybody left. More shrews for me. Gosh, look at that. We're at 335 now. More shrews for me. Oh, we only have 32 seconds left. Okay, fine. I'll grab the soil. Um, Jaden, you said I know them feels. PlayStation came out when I had a Super Nintendo and a Nintendo 64, but loved the heck out of it regardless. <laughs> nice. What heck yeah. We had 337 shrews now. Let's go, guys. We're doing so good. What can I do for you? Look at all this XP. We're going to be, oh my god, we're going to be level 125 before I know it. I'm going to out-level all of my main story. Ugh. Are you streaming on multiple platforms? Yes, I am. I'm streaming on YouTube and Twitch. Um, I wasn't even sure about it. I was thinking about uh, video games were stupid. Even now they don't understand. I'm slowly explaining to them the positives of gaming online with people. It's like a form of interactive art. Yeah, I'd love to drop a follow everywhere if I'm able. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Hi, Pipe Pipe. Yeah, um, same thing with my family. I don't think that... I don't know. It, it, it's... It's... I'm in a very weird spot with my family about gaming because it's like... I take streaming very, like, seriously. Like, I mean, I rely on streaming for income now with the way that I've done things, like, uh, partially anyway. It, like, streaming's like a part-time job for me. Um, so I like to think of it like work. But when my family, I don't know, they, they, they do still, like, they're supportive and they're happy to see that it makes me happy. But I think that they don't see it like a job. And I just think, I think it's just a lack of understanding and totally, uh, to be honest. Um, and 
they do just see it like I'm just playing video games, I guess. So I've just hate like I've just played with friends. I'm just killing time or whatever. And they're like, you know, like, especially when I started streaming and I wasn't making any money from it. They were like. Aubrey, you spent so much in this, you know, <laughs> uh, M, yes, yay, found you. Yes, thank you for the YouTube sub. Thank you. A uh, Lewis, he said, Chow Strawberry. Got <laughs> catch you later. Thanks, Lewis. Uh, Snorgar, you said, I had a DS and a Wii, and then my dad got me a laptop. Been a PC gamer ever since. Has yeah, Snorgar, let's go. Heck yeah. Um, but yeah, I think my family's kind of in this weird boat where it's like if it's important stuff and I'm busy because I'm in my eyes, I'm like. I'm streaming, I'm working, in a sense. They're like, well, you need to make time for other things because you're just playing video games. You need to answer your phone when I call because you're just playing video games. And I'm like, no. <laughs> like, if it's an emergency, yeah. But like, you know, if you want to talk to me about like something that had just happened, we can wait, you know, because I'm working, yo. <laughs> like, so it's kind of... It's kind of this weird thing right now with my fam. Uh, hi, you said, from what level should I have gone to bed? I don't know. I think it's 130. I know I'm like, I need to go to the veils right now, hi. And I think that after the veils, I'll get to gone to bed, I guess. Alay Santi said, hi, just discovered your YouTube channel. I haven't played in three years and I wanted to check out the new zones, one to 35, if I'm correct. How should I do it? Uh, yeah, so. Well, welcome in for starters, Sasan. Um, I think for new zones, well, you said you haven't played in three years. Okay. Um, you probably were around when Wildwood came out. So this is kind of like the new map lately. Uh, Bree has Wildwood. I don't know. I feel like this was like three or four years ago when Wildwood came out. So probably when you stopped. But um, Wildwood is a level 40-ish, 40, closer to 45-ish shown, I would say. Um, that's in Bree. Easy way to check it out. Just go through Bree Stable Master, ride your way out there. Bada boom, bada beam, you are there. Um, I don't think you have to purchase Wildwood. I could be mistaken. Uh, Shire, there is now yonder Shire. So now past Needle Hole, instead of having that like teleporting like zone where you get to Arid Lewin, now there's an actual place called Yonder Shire that you will have to pay Lotro points for. Uh, it is a quest pack, I believe. I think it's only like 595 Lotro points. So you could grind it with deeds and stuff. But I really liked Yonder Shire. I actually just played it for the first time ever, like last month. <laughs> and it was it was really cute. It's it is pretty much like the Shire done over again. Um, but I do like the quests. A lot of the quests were all, they were very funny. They were very cute. Um so yeah, so that one you would have to like save up for. You could either pay money or you could just do deeds, like I said, and grind the Lotro points that way. Um, but they, they should go on sale soon, I'm assuming, what, send, uh, sometime in April because the anniversary is coming up. I would assume there'd be some kind of quest pack expansion deal going on soon. So if you wanted to do that, um, that is an option as well. Um, Troll Shaws came out with the angle of myth mythethial i think it's called um that's a level oh yeah yonder shire is 20 and above i should mention it's a 20 and above zone so um pretty early on in the game the angle that came out um not long ago either that came out around the time as yonder shire it's a level 45 is shown um this one is like the highly most talked about compared to any others from what i've heard um, I haven't played it myself. That also is a quest pack thing that you'll have to save up for. Uh, very similar to Yonder Shire. And then the away? biggest thing that came out that's new uh, for early level-ish stuff is before the Shadow expansion. Now that you would have to save up for as well. I don't even have this, but this costs like close to 2,000 Lotro points or so. Uh, probably a bit more. Um, but you can still check out the area. Um, now the South Guard uh, ruins down here in Bree. It actually has a path forward, which would take you to Cardolan. Uh, you can also enter in through the Lone Lands, and it's over by like the Goblin area, the Warg area over here. You can go to Cardolan that way too. Um, so there's a lot to explore over here, but like I said, this one's going to be the pricier one. Uh, Before the Shadow is new, like tutorial stuff, so it's like level 1 through 20, I believe. So, um, 
yeah, it's a lot of fun. Cardolan and Swanfleet are the before the shadow regions, so... I hope that answered your question. It was very extensive. Uh, Snorgar, you said, I feel like we'll have similar reactions later when we are older, even as gamers. Um, or there'll be something different, like gaming to our elders that we don't un we won't understand. Yeah, probably. We'll all grow older and be like, oh man, we just don't get it. I mean, I almost, I almost stopped gaming. There was like... I think I got into SWTOR like around 2020, and then I moved. No, it was 2019. I'm sorry. That's what happened. That's what happened. COVID brought me back into gaming. That is what happened. Because 2019, um, in the fall, I um, was living at home and I was going to college. And my college was like, I basically drive like two hours every day to go to school for my classes. And I just didn't like it. So I eventually moved uh, to the college town that I was always, you know, commuting to. And, um... Yeah, I, I lived in a very small, very small, it was like a closet, basically. I was living in a closet. There's no way I could even afford to pay internet because I was a little college kid. And uh, there was just a room for my computer. And honestly, I was weaning off of games. And I was just like, I don't get the point of gaming. Like, I wasn't playing Lotro. I wasn't playing anything. So I almost... I, I was heavily considering selling my gaming PC. Or, I guess my PC, I guess. It wasn't a gaming PC. And then COVID hit, and I was like, well, there's nothing to do, so I might as well just game more, I guess. So, I started gaming more, and then I reactivated my Swotor membership and got back into Lotro, and the rest is history. <laughs> it's kind of crazy, man. Yeah, I would have, I totally would have stopped and I would have been like, what's the point of gaming, you know? Like, I was genuinely in that phase where I was like, I don't get why people game at my age because there's just so much to like look forward to. I can't wait to like go out and like experience things. And then COVID hit and COVID was like, nah, girl, you staying home. Uh, Wisp Knight, hello. Hey, just found you on the recommended chan channels and you popped up. Aw, let's go. All right, I desperately need a soil though. Um, you said, I, uh, I love seeing people play Lotro. I just played a little of it, but when I see it, I feel nostalgia. Cool stream, glad to be here. Yeah, thanks Wes and I for being here. I appreciate it. Sorry, it took me a minute to get to your, um, to get to your comment. I'm sorry. How can I be of service? I ramble too much. But yeah, thank you for being here. I appreciate it a bunch. Yeah, Lotro was definitely nostalgia. I can't believe how long I played this game for. And I just can't believe how... It always brings me back, yo. Yeah, thank you. I had enough points to, per to purchase before the shadow. Ooh, nice. I'm glad. Yeah, I'm still, I'm still trying to save for it. But honestly, like, like I said, it is like a tutorial-based, like, beginner area. So to me, I'm just like, eh, like, I already have a lot of places to do my level 1 through 20 quests. I don't want to add more, so I just haven't bought it. I am saving for River Hobbit, though, which is one of the newer races that came out, um, I think it's September. August or September. It's very recent, but I'm still, I'm still saving for River Hobbit. I love it. Yeah, Mbar is the latest expansion for max level, so now the max level is 150, so Mbar is, like, level 140 to 150. So I tell you to save for that sort of stuff too. It's not in the Lotra store yet. It will be in the Lotra store come May. Um, but uh, the only way that you can purchase that is with money on the Lotra.com uh, Lotra website where they have the bundle available. Snorgar, you said I will never understand how people will not try this game purely because of the graphics. Because it's old and such, I truly don't think the graphics look bad. It just adds, um, plus it's still nostalgia. Right. Yeah, I don't get why people always frown upon this game either like i i always hear it gosh from like everybody man my ex i always try to get him into this game he wouldn't even budge it's like these graphics are terrible what do you do in the game you just run around and stuff i'm like yeah what makes it different than minecraft which you know of course he liked but lotro is just nah 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 but anyway that looks like Jules. Very much looks like Jules' character, anyway. Yeah, I don't get that either, Sorgar. Like, I'm just like, eh. 
But they're lost, you know, if they if they don't want to play because of the graphics not looking stellar. I mean, I think these graphics look pretty okay. I mean, gosh, when someone showed me a picture of Rune RuneScape, I think, I was like, how the frick does RuneScape seem to have, like, so many people talk so highly about it? Yet, we're sitting here in Lotro, and Lotro's got better graphics? The RuneScape, if you if you tell me, like, like RuneScape looks, it looks bad, bro. It looks really bad. <laughs> I think it's RuneScape. I've never played it, but, like, I, I've always heard stuff about it. It was, like, the top MMO, like, an older MMO anyway. But then, like, someone actually, yeah, old school RuneScape. People showed me a picture of what it looks like. And I'm like, bruh. The pixels, uh, they updated it from what it looks, but even in the updated doesn't look like, I mean, I guess the updated does look a lot better now. But like, my golly. I'm like, I don't, I don't, I don't get it. I just don't get it. I don't, I just don't get it. Like graphics are such a big deal anyway. But that's me. I'm someone who likes to play like I really want to get into on the channel. I really want to get into playing like indie ho horror games or Stay indie home. games of the sort that just have like dreadful graphics. But sometimes those are like the best <laughs> dreadful graphics, like just weird glitches and stuff. Like it's just it's so funny. This berry lemonade is actually really good. I really like it. Snorgar, you said sure, it may be 2007 tech, but it's not bad at all. The only bad thing about the engine is the server performance. Exactly. Yeah, the server, I definitely understand. Like, don't get me wrong. There are gripes about the game performance-wise and just, like, software-wise I have issues with, I guess. But, I mean, what game doesn't have issues? And, I mean, Lotro, I won't lie, yeah, they do got some pretty serious issues that they gotta sort through, which you know, other games, I don't see why this would be a big problem. Like, this was something that probably would have been resolved for any other company, but I don't know anything. I'm not in the software engineering field, so I guess I I can't say, I guess. Do you guys think we could stomp on 30 shrews in, like, the three-minute timer? I don't know. That'd be 10 shrews a minute. 10 shrews a minute? That'd be hard with the soil, because the soil takes like 20. I'd have to really be on it. We, we can see. No lag! No lag! Lag stream! Okay, well the stream's lagging on Twitch anyway. I don't know about YouTube. I don't know why that's happening lately again. Mm -mm. Lag, refresh refresh it's so funny too because i lag but i <laughs> i lag on stream on the twitch side but there's no issue that i can't send chats which is just so funny to me that's so funny oh well it's always it's always when i'm about to start the shrew stomping too man wtf all right well it doesn't look like it's buffering anymore but we're still losing frames so Energy drinks are the best water. No, energy drinks are awful for you. Do not drink energy drinks, Scott. Don't do it. Sorry, guy, I've had no issues with the game, both on my PC and my laptop. Uh. Oh, I put on a bubble. Whoops. Uh, I just wish that they had a remember me button. <laughs> two factor. Yeah, I wish they had two factor. They need two factor. I'm very upset with them that they don't have two factor yet. Very, very upset. Very disappointed. Oh, we're still dropping. The heck? Yeah, it's lagging here too, but it's... Oh, uh, dang! It's my internet. Just my internet acting up. Just keep refreshing, guys. All good now. Yeah, well, it's, it's technically not. It's still gonna buffer because I'm still dropping frames right now. Oh, no, it's good, good now. It's good, good now. It's good, good now. Okay, yeah, it's good, good. It's actual good, good now.
Right? Bitrate good? Yeah, bitrate better. Okay, yeah, sorry about that. That's just, uh, oh. How the frick did I miss that? I was right there! Okay, whatever game. That was baloney. Someone literally just, I guess, just clicked it faster. That was real, that was something. That was something, man. Anyway, um, yeah, sorry. Hey, Goldwyn. How you doing today, Goldwyn? I'm so sad. I think that's the first enormous shrew I've missed today, though, so I guess I can't be that upset. No, that was the second one, maybe. But still, I guess I can't be upset. We played- we played for- oh, it's almost two hours! We played for almost two hours, and I literally have missed two enormous shrews, okay? I guess I can't be that upset about it. <laughs> It's not like I need the spring leaves anyway, I really don't. I just need the shrew shrews. Six more shrews! Six more shrews for the need! Oh my gosh, there we go, there we go. Then we're done. I'm never coming back here again. That's not true, I probably will. You know what, I don't even care. I don't even freaking care, yo. I don't even care if I, if I miss the quest. I don't need the box. I don't need it. I did it! I did it! I did it! I did it! I got the deed done! Oh my gosh, 400 shrews done! Tamer of the Shrews, bro! Oh my god, all out for a title. Hey, it was so worth it. Alright, let's go, uh, let's go jump on some fences. Let's get angry now. I'm good, thanks. Went to see the Bob Marley movie tonight and it was really good. I've heard it's pretty decent. That's good, I'm glad though. Lost Shire, I'm a master tonight. Sally on my iPad, you on my phone, and both chats on my laptop. <laughs> Heck yeah. Wait, Sally's live now? She is! Arkenstoners, because grief is beating me senseless. Uh, okay. Coffee's still up too, nice. What's Coffee doing? He's, uh, he's in Barrow Downs, it looks. Oh no, he's in North Downs. Oop. What's Sally doing? Is she doing Spring Fest? She is doing Spring Fest. So we, I feel like no one's doing Spring Fest anymore. I just feel, I feel so out of it. Sweet All right, well, now I don't know what to do with my life. I still do need to get to, uh... wait, why did I do that? Sweet I could just man. take a swift travel to Brock and Borings. My golly, wasted my coin. Gosh, look at how many boxes I've got. <laughs> oh my gosh, oh my golly. Yikes, big yikes, big yikes. Yeah, I, um... I just wanted to get that deed done. I don't know why I wanted that title so bad. But yeah, I feel like nobody's doing Spring Fest anymore. Look at how many Spring Leaves I'm getting just from these boxes. Guys, if you ever need Spring Leaves in the, in the Spring Fest, the best place to get them is from stomping some shrews. Very, very helpful. It's very good. Thanks for the lurk, and So much love gonna lurk. Thank you. I appreciate it so much. It helps out a bunch. Thank you. Thank you. Um, yeah. Um, gosh, how many spring leaves am I at now? 165? Oh! Good day. You know what? Well, Would it be crazy if we started with the north one I first? No, time? let's do south first. Let's do south first. I take a I'm going crazy time? mode on him. Yep, she's on arc with Lee doing spring feds. Okay, cool. Well, dang, I would have invited her um, to the fellow, but she's... She's an arc and stone in. She can't be... She can't be arc stone in it today. How dare she? <gasps> I was on it! I was on it and then it like kicked me off! Ah, uh, okay, we're lagging again. We're lagging because I'm drunk. I forgot that that cause... <laughs> Here, let me do this real quick. Alright, I'm gonna fix the lag. You ready? Y'all ready? Go ready for me to fix the lag? Oh yeah, make sure you refresh too, because that's been happening. I should start a comp tune? Wait, what do you mean, Dan? Starting a comp tune? Yeah, make sure you just keep refreshing, because this does happen with the lag when it gets bad, because I'm literally like two minutes behind from previous lag. Oh, come on. Do your thing, man. Do your thing. Thanks for the lurk, Goldwyn. 
I could take you on a house tour or three, you say, Lost Shire Hobbit? Oh, frick. I hope... Aw. I totally, I totally got disconnected from the fellow when I closed out a game. Yeah, so I don't know why, but um, this is something that happens I, from now on. Anytime I get drunk in the game, it causes us to lag. So um, we're going to probably lag a bit. It happens. Just make sure you keep refreshing because um, what's happening is that even if it's not buffering, like the stream isn't buffering, uh, the delay is like so incredibly long. So just make sure you keep refreshing. Um, Lasha, you said when you're at your Lindsay house and it's snowing with northern lights and pink and white trees. Lag so bad, need better internet. I literally have the best internet in my area. I just need to move and I cannot afford to move. Um, so there's that. <laughs> uh, drow guy, I slapped you and got away with it because of lag. <laughs> Dude, that's so incredibly funny though. What the frick? Oh my golly. Yeah, I literally, I literally, guys, I have the best internet in my area. I cannot get fiber. I live in an apartment. They will not allow me to get fiber. <laughs> so I'm, uh, I'm literally all out of options. I just need to move somewhere that would have it. But chances are I'd have to live in a house. And your girl don't got money for a house right now. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> Um, so yeah, so just, just keep that in mind that there will be a delay. The buffering will happen when we're drunketh. Um, so it is what it is. Just bear with, just refresh. Just keep refreshing. That's so funny though, Drow Guy. Uh, all right. I'm going to log back in. Do my thing. Didn't realize how dark it was getting. It's like eight o'clock already. Jeez. What the freak? Yeah, sometimes, so this is funny too. I'll probably log back in and I won't be drunk. I like, I like the camera will like move and stuff, but like it won't show the green like screen or whatever. So <laughs> it's quite funny. It's quite funny how that works, I guess. Do, 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 do. Yeah, see, here we go. No green screen. Could I take a moment of your time? Boop. 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 Oh, I'm getting the friends list glitch too. Wait, Lawshire, can you can you um can you invite me back? I can't I can't find your character's name. I know it starts with an E. I totally fell out. Oh. Guess we'll do the north side now. Just shared in the Discord. Sorry, I just saw something on the Discord and I just, I saw a message from someone and I'm just... Uh, um... Where? Where in the Discord? Huh, a few from your house? Hell yeah. That's so cute. Drunk on fence again? Heck yeah, son and CV know it. Hey, yeah, I need I need to to prove myself on the fences. We can do this. We can do this. I'm very concentrated. We will get this. Oh, okay. Phew. That was close. Lag! 
Time to go to sleep. Good night. Have a good night, Star Star Guard. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it. Uh, could I take a moment of your time? <sighs> no, I don't want to do the OG Hello, one. I just want to do North and South right now. I need to prove myself as a Lotro player by completing these challenges quickly. Lag. I can't- I haven't even gotten on the tent yet. Dude, lag's really tripping me up. Dude, I don't know why it's causing internet issues. Hello there. For for stream, but not only that, my lag in the game is just astronomically terrible when I'm drunk like this. <laughs> I don't know what the problem is. It hasn't been that bad like previously with more players on. Like what the heck was that lag? That's just so funny. It's like less people are playing it now, and now it's becoming more of an issue. Good day. Might I have a word with you? Do 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 do. I don't know how I'm on that fence, yo. Whew. No! I didn't jump far enough. Okay, we could do this. We could do this. We could do this. We could do this. Dude, the north one, I am just failing at before even getting there. Oh, uh, thank you, Lashar Hobbit. Do, 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 do. There we go. All right, at least made it to the tent. Progress, right? Ah, oh, totally fell off. Didn't jump far enough. Oh, totally ran into it. My bad. All right, south one again. This south isn't too terrible. I can't believe Gantron got the north one with no problem, but he was struggling so bad on the south one that one day. I was like, I have the total opposite, yo. Like, I am the total opposite. The south one is like almost no problem, but the north one is just like awful for me. I just struggle so bad with it. Hello there. Might I speak with you a moment? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Concentration time, come on. Lag. Oh, oh I almost fail. My character would have rolled, it would have been over. Oh, I don't know how I'm on it. Oh, I over jumped it. Ugh. Ugh, I hurt. Hey, Sergeant! Sergeant Major Fish. Five stream streak, let's go. Uh, hello as well. Oh, jeez! Thank you for the gifted to Rob King of the Plants! Whoa! Hello there. Uh, thank you, oh, jeez, for the gifted. Um, thank you, thank you all. Sergeant, you said, uh, I gotta go to bed early tonight. My dad is having cataract surgery in the morning, so I have to stay with my daughter so mom can take a- Ooh. Man, good luck to your dad, man. Wow, I actually lagged, hit the ground, but it showed me on the fence. I don't know what is going on with lag. I totally did a full jump, but it showed I did a half jump. Stay. Lag is so bad, yo. <laughs> the floor is lava, Lotro style. Exactly. You know it, but make it that we're drunk on top of it. Like, just, just add on top of it that we're drunk, because that's Lotro style. Like, lag is actually pushing me, though. How dare it push me? Oof. That was not a long enough jump. Gadget, you feel like, I feel like I've seen this show before? Yep. <laughs> Welcome back to your, uh, <laughs> regularly scheduled fence hopping. We haven't even done the mazes, guys. That's the craziest part. We have not done any of the mazes. 
for Bree. I haven't done any of the maze quests. Ooh, I almost fell off. Ooh, that was a close one. What? Whatever! That was baloney! That was total baloney. Every time it would let me get up there, but that time it was like, nah! Nah, you getting kicked by the fence, Aubrey. My wonderful daughter got me a Darth Vader pen holder! Oh. I'm so jealous. Tell your daughter to get me one, please. And thank you. Be like, can I get a Darth Vader pen holder, please? Okay, that was something. Hey, Gantaron, how you doing? How's it going, Gantaron? Ah, I'm trying to do the fences and it's not going well and lag is being harsh, to say the least. It's a going, it's a going. Okay, well, I guess maybe it's my camera angle is messing up. I don't know. I'm going to start jumping on that pole, though. Could I take a moment of your time? Because I don't know why the fences are giving me issues where they're like kicking me. Like I keep running into them, basically, instead of jumping like on them. Very weird. I'm holding my space bar, I swear. I'm holding it. Hold. That was just me. That was totally me. Oh, I gave up last night. You did get her on. Dude, I don't know why. I'm I'm actually really struggling today. Hello there. Might I speak with you like, moment? I'm struggling with Hello stuff there. that like I've Might not I run into. Vader is kneeling and he holds the pen like he just made it for me. Oh my golly. You're his master, Sergeant Major Fish. He's extending it to you. Wow, I actually missed though. I'm actually gonna lose it. I'm doing so bad. Like I'm not even making it far, and I'm failing these. Hello there. Might I speak with you a moment? Like, normally I keep failing. Like I normally fail over towards the end of the south one, but I keep I'm I'm I can't even do the first one, which is God. It's going on. What's going on today? Like the north one, it was taking me forever just to get to the tent here. Then I finally got to the tent, and now I'm actually starting to fail where I, I normally fail, you know? Like, right over here. <laughs> the very first one. Barkey said, why does the game sometimes look like you are high? I saw this happen on some areas. Uh, well, we are drinking right now, so that's why that's happening for Could us, I Bar. A of your time? Um, yeah, if you have oh, this any other area, I'm not sure. Uh, Ganteron, I was getting stuttering issues multiple times during a single jump. Yes, I'm having it so bad lately. Same, like, that's what keeps happening to me. I keep, I keep like, uh, uh, uh. and I'm like, bro, like, let me jump, bro. Like, yeah, I don't know why, but it's like not even registering my jumps anymore. Ooh, see it lag there. Yeah, there was one. You should have seen it, bro. I literally just jumped and I <laughs> I had jumped and legit I jumped. I fell off the fence, hit the grass. Then I lagged back on the fence and I could still keep going. Quite funny. A G swear. Thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the weird community. Hello, I hope you're having a good I day today. A Welcome in. Well, we got the south one done. That was nice. That didn't take too long, okay? I'm done complaining. Uh, but the north one, oof. This one always takes me like a good hour to get. So, uh, hold tight, guys, uh, for a good hour. <laughs> I'll try to be quick. No promises, though. At least this one doesn't have the cooldown, so it's a lot easier to just hurry up and get back to it. Like, I just keep- I just keep falling. It's like I lag fall off of it. Jeesper, hello, hello, how you doing today? How are Could you? How's it going? Oh geez, he said, okay, not to backseat, but I can tell you why it's not registering your jumps. You aren't yelling parkour every time you jump. Oh, that's fair. Okay. Okay, I'll do that on the pulls. How about that? I'll just yell parkour each time. And then it'll work. Oh, I see I almost lagged off the fence! 
The lag is pushing me though. How dare it? How actually? How dare it? What was that? I like fell on it, off of it, on it. <laughs> Lotro with no lag would be the perfect game. No draw. Exactly, Bar. I'm so with you. I'm so with you. I think everybody could agree. Lotro would have like two times the amount of people playing with uh, no lag. <laughs> But that make the game too easy, right? Right. Do 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 do. Harry Potter. Okay. All right, we're gonna try OG's method. Parkour. <laughs> <laughs> I parkoured off that fence. All right. <laughs> I thought it had to be how loud you scream. Oh, yeah, maybe that's I it. Take a moment of your time. I could try that again. <laughs> Screw my neighbors. No, I had to... Last time, what worked best and what got me furthest was when I was sweet-talking. I think last Shirehava told me to sweet-talk the poles. I was like, all right, I'll do that. And I was like, you know, I was just saying nice things about it. All right, let's try it again. You are the nicest pole to ever exist. Nope, it didn't like that. <laughs> it literally said, F off, me. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, see, the lag is what... It's like I make it, but then lag makes it that I don't make it. It's like a delayed lag fail. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Alright, well, I can't even make the first jump. This is not going too well. I literally just flew off of the other one. All right. <laughs> Stunning Steve. No, we need Lotro hard mode. Extra lag spikes every five to ten seconds. I am good on that. Um, downvote that one big time, Stunning Steve. Hey, Patty, how's it going? A part is difficult. You say Jasper? Yes, yes, yes. It is. I can definitely do it. I've done it. I think I've passed this, what, like... I think I've completed the north one a good... five times now? Four or five times now? Which took me 16 years to get to this point, so, uh... I'm definitely thrilled about it. Like, how the hell am I on this pole? No way. I should not have made that. And then I just fling off the other one. I don't know what's going on with the flinging. It's being a lot more cruel. Hmm, that's weird. Might I have a word? Um, Patty, you said, wasn't it me who told you that yesterday? Oh, yeah, maybe. I was like, I couldn't remember. It was either you or Lost Shire Hobbit. Maybe you both told me. Do -do -do -do. <laughs> like, what was that jump? I don't know if that was me or the game. Like, I swear I jumped more than that, but all right. <laughs> Lost Shire, you're on a dance tour? Heck yeah. Good day. Might I have a word with you? <sighs> Some say this quest is polarizing. What? <laughs> it's polarizing, you say, OG? <laughs> it's polar. I mean, that's. That's, <laughs> that's actually fair, though. Um... <clears throat> like, you're not wrong. Like, what was that? I didn't even move, and I fell off of it. It's like, the game takes a second to realize if, like, you're barely on it, and then they just knock you off anyway. Hello there. That's so weird. I speak with you a hey, Kale, how's it going? I'm here to bring the Croy burps. Oh! That's right! You're the LaCroix burper! <laughs> okay, I don't have a LaCroix, but I do have uh, sparkling water. Which is basically the same thing. Uh, so, I guess I, I guess I have to burp now. What the frick was that? It, like, flew me! What's everyone do you play on? Uh, G Spur? I play on... Crick Hollow. Hello there! Hello there. <laughs> it's all TV static anyway. It counts. That's true. Gantaron, give me the weird hydrate. Thank you, Gantaron. We'll weird hydrate and then I will sip my sparkling. Woo! 
See, that's why I don't like LaCroix um, or any sort of like bubbly water, I guess is what it's called or something of the sort. Um, but I have flavored sparkling, which is carbonated, but it's not really that carbonated. It's more like, I don't know, it doesn't taste like juice, but it tastes like flavored water. But like carbonated. <laughs> I'll try to say, yeah, I still need dances. Wait, really? I thought you got them all. Oh, maybe on one character. I do need to get more dances on my alts. Ices are really good, right? The pomegranate ones are the pretty good. I know, those are so good. Yeah, my sparkling ice. Yeah, man. Yeah, the pomegranate one's so good. I've been drinking the um, grape. I think it's a grape raspberry one a lot lately. The one I have right now is a berry lemonade because we got a lemonade like flavor package. Dude, my camera is so wonky. What? I was kind of off of it. It's okay. Like, I was so off to the side. It was weird. But yeah, I'm glad. You know, I'm glad that I finally have someone who can understand the sparkling water. Could I take a moment of your uh, Like, uh, vibes, you know? Jeez, for almost. I know. It's progress. We can do it. I've definitely done it. We can do it. I don't give up. I don't like to give up. Oh my gosh, lag! Oh, I almost rolled off! That's the problem with doing this on a high elf. It's not that nice. It's not that kind to you. <laughs> like, what the frick was that kind of lag, bro? Whatever. Is it easier to not skip any? No, it is so much harder to not to to do to if you skipping is way easier than not skipping. Oh, that was lag. Yeah, that was total lag. Lag was like it. Eh? <laughs> Scott, a high elf. Yes, yes, and, and yeah. Don't do this on both of the, both senses. I guess a high elf who's also high. It's just it's not it's not it's not good. Ooh, that was me. I didn't hold W long enough. Um, yeah, no, if I, like, it's so hard to, the problem with these, with the pulls, is that it's so hard to stay on them. Like the, like the hitbox or whatever you'd say, of like your character being on it is so small. So if I could limit that by skipping them, i totally do that. What was that? What was that? <laughs> That was just... Oh my golly. Oh, this Marcus, game. Ellie is the last one and she needs four. Oh, she needs them all, man. Almost. Almost all. I'm concentrated. I'm sorry. I missed. Jump too much. What was that? You teleported? I did teleport. This happens frequently during these fence challenges. I teleport Could often. I the funniest teleport, it was like I teleported three times to the same location. And I was like, pretty much like what happened was like I, I jumped onto a fence. It teleported me back to the previous fence. Then it teleported me on the ground. And then it teleported me back on the fence that I had jumped to that I had made and then it teleported me It like kicked me off of it and teleported me back to the ground and said I failed. I was like oof. Oh my gosh I think it would be difficult to do this sober <laughs> Honestly, it, if you take out the drunk effects off the game, which you can do um I almost died to a jester. It's Terraria watching. It's dangerous here. Ooh. Heck yeah. Uh, but yeah, honestly, if you take off the drunk effects and do this sober, uh, which I have done very few times, um, it actually makes kind of like a world of a difference more than I thought. I didn't realize the drunk effect made it 
way more challenging than I actually thought. I think the problem is I'm rotating my camera and it keeps knocking me off while because I'm rotating while jumping in the air. And that's the problem. All right, let's do the easy one just so I can get some confidence back up. Oh, man. And then there are people I know who actually do this while drunk, which is like insane to me. Like IRL drunk. And I'm like, yo. You're drunk in game and IRL? How the heck do you do that? No way. All right, well, that one was so easy. That was a breeze. All right, we could do anything. We did that one one time, no problem. So we can definitely do this one time, no problem, right? That's how it works. Just speed run it. This needs to be a speed running competition. I'm calling it. I'm going to set that up next year. I'm going to set this up as a speedrun competition. What was that? It just... It just totally... Wow, okay. It totally just walked me off. I jumped. Hello there. Anyway. I but yeah, I totally want to set this up as a speed competition. Speedrun. Whoever gets to the north one fastest wins. <laughs> and this is my practice round. Lag. You sure have pers perseverance? Yes. This is what I do. This is my life. I do not okay. give up. Might I have a word with you? I'm just too. I I get too like a uh, uh, like obsessed over it. I'm like no. Even though the lag is telling me otherwise. Yeah, that's the thing with it. This would be so much easier without lag. But it is what it is, I guess. Maybe I should skip the second ones instead of the first ones. Yeah, like instead, here, I'll try it next time. I'll do the fence and I'll do the second pole and then this pole. I'm not familiar with the jump styles of that, though, so I don't think we'll make it that far, but... We're not making it far as it is. Master of Dungeons, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the weird community. I hope you're having a good day today. Again, Tehran, they cancel each other out. <laughs> yep, that's how it works, man. Maybe. Alright, I'm gonna start skipping. Like, what the heck is this lag? You stop it, lag. You stop it. Alright, let's do the second one. Ooh, like, I really don't know the jump style. Oh. <gasps> no, I didn't know! That was totally me! That was totally me! I, that was totally me! I was like... I was deciding, like, mid-jump if I go on the first one or the second one, and I couldn't decide! And I messed it up! Oh my god, that was totally me! I totally got in my brain, yo! <laughs> that was actually me for real, for real, though. I'm so upset with myself. <laughs> I was like, I'll go for the second one, and then it was like, mid-jump, I was like, no, I'm gonna go for the first one. <laughs> and then I was like, wait, it's too late. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, okay, well, that wasn't too bad. Uh, let's try it again, I guess. I walked off that one. That was me. Oh, it's it's not nighttime anymore. The sun is arising in the Shire. Stay and have some tea. Ten hour stream of the ground is lava. <laughs> no, it won't be ten hours. Normally, it takes me an hour at most. It used to take me like ten hours. But not anymore. Not anymore. We become low key kind of amateurs now, all right? We're amateur status. I walked off of it. That was me again. What am I doing? I'm getting two in my head. Anyone play on Landy? Uh, I know, uh, a couple Hello people there. who do. I think I Goldwyn, if Goldwyn's still in the chat, I think they play on Landfall sometimes. Definitely for concerts and shows, for sure, for sure. Um, You might, uh, I don't know if you're interested in doing this at all, the Master of Dungeons, but 
Uh, you might want to go in my Discord and ask, because uh, you'll probably get a better response on there, because I don't know who all is lurking and stuff right now. That was stupid. Golden, I do. It's pretty awesome. It's my main server. Yeah, that's what I thought. Let's go. Spring Fest Friday and Saturday, you say, Dan? Uh, Spring Fest today, tomorrow at 1 p.m. EST, Saturday. I don't have a stream time yet. Probably closer to about 2 p.m. EST. I just start later because I have some... My godmother is in town. So, yeah, Spring Fest then. Uh, I'm hoping tomorrow we can do some... Because I want to have a longer stream tomorrow. Tommy, thank you so much for the YouTube sub. Welcome to the weird community. I hope you're having a good day today. Um, but I'm hoping... I'm hoping tomorrow, because I want to have a longer stream, I'm hoping tomorrow we could do some main story quests. Um, but today I just wanted to get Springfest, like, dailies done. Call it a shorter one. Because I, I want to film some videos tonight. Possibly, I don't know. I thought I'd have the videos written out, but I don't. I do need to get some client work done, like, really, really badly, so... Um, I need to have a shorter stream tonight, but tomorrow should be longer, because... I got the whole day to stream, pretty much. Oh yeah, I think we're doing Lady Dwarven Night tomorrow, actually. I think I'm doing two streams tomorrow, that's right! I think I'm having two streams tomorrow, so... Oh, I did the OG pattern that I normally do. Um, yeah, I think we're having two streams tomorrow, because, um... I'll do Spring Fest again. Do some main story, probably call it, eat some dinner. And then, like, later, Jules, Copy, and I will be doing Dwarven Ladies. Master, you said it's my only server. Uh, been there since the beginning. Heck yeah! Let's go. Uh, yeah, and then Saturday will be Spring Fest. Sunday will also be Spring Fest. And then it'll be the final Spring Fest day. And then we'll be done. I won't do it on Monday, because I don't stream Monday. So... What the heck? I fell off, but it gave me credit. Oh my gosh, lag worked with me. Lag helped me. Thank you, lag. Thank you. You helped me. One time. One time. <laughs> Dude, lag is so corrupt. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my golly. Okay, I have a small presence on Crick and Ser Ser Serenon too? Oh, I didn't know that. Is there like a stream team or anything for Lotro? There is the Lotro stream. I could not tell you who is on it. I do not follow. I do not follow. Plus they change like who's on the team because sometimes stuff happens and some people have to drop out or whatever. But I am not on it for other reasons. <laughs> Oops, didn't purchase it for Sergeant Tom. Whoa. <laughs> Heck yeah, dude. That was awesome. I can't believe the lag worked for us. For once. For once in my freaking life, it actually helped. <sighs> Alright, well that didn't take too long. That probably took us like 30 minutes. That wasn't too bad. Gotta work first. Wait, what? Gotta work. A lovely That's not day, okay. No working allowed. A lovely day, isn't it? Lovely day. Does anyone in the chat want a gift? Anybody want a clover patch or a wooden keg or a, a tank guard or a hat or pints of brew? Speak up. Forever hold your peace. A day, isn't it? Good day. Do -do -do. Then I had some boxes available. Maybe? Danny said yay back to two stream days. <laughs> yeah, two, two, two streams per day. Heck yeah. Oh, what? Do you want, Patty, do you want like a clover patch or do you want any of these rewards? Because I'll send it to some people on Crick Hollow. Uh, Dan, oh, Twitch schedule is different, I think. Yeah, Twitch, I need to update. I need to update the schedules on everything. I think the only accurate schedule there is right now is just Discord, and literally Discord just says today and tomorrow stream. And even tomorrow stream's messed up because I forgot about Dwarven Ladies. I thought the hat and such were bound to account. Oh. Well, not the hat, because that does say bind to account on acquire. Uh, the tankard might not be. 
Uh, is the clover patch on small? Do I not have the clover patch? I thought for sure I, I've gotten one. I might have put it in the kin hall. That's probably what I did. Yeah, I probably did that. Whoopsies. Um, yikes. Big yikes. Oh, no, thank you. Okay, I'm just going to give Bruda friends. Because that's what people have been doing to me. So I'll just return the favor. All right, you guys want to go do some Bree maze quests? I have to work tomorrow on Saturday. Oh, no, no, no. It's okay. I'll be live Just for tomorrow. a good chunk of time tomorrow. Two streams tomorrow. Two streams. Yeah, so it'll be 1 p.m. EST tomorrow for more Spring Fest, um, main story quest, and... Yeah, and then we'll wrap up stream there, and then Dwarven Ladies Nights typically is like 7 p.m. EST. I should, I should say EDT. I have to correct myself because I forgot that daylight saving times happened like two weeks ago. So it's EDT, sorry. But 7 p.m. EDT. So pretty much like around this time tomorrow I'll be live too. Um, and then earlier. Okay, where was I going? I'm trying to get to Bree. Get me to Bree, please! Yeah, and then Sunday will be Spring Fest. And... Yeah. I don't know. A lovely day, isn't it? Da 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 do. Da 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 do. Maze quests are <laughs> are these the quests when the creepy high elf stalk the poor tweens? Yes it is, Gadget. Yes it is. You know it, man, you know it. Uh I don't know what to do after the maze quests. What do we do? I can't believe we're gonna be level 125 soon. I'm actually like quite in awe about that. Oh, frog jelly. I don't know who this is, but hello. They are fishing. They fishing, fishing. All right, here's Sergeant Tom. There you go. Give me my spring. Oh wait, I need to do instances. That's what I gotta do too. Let's do some instances right now for uh. I need to do the big bees one. I hear people slapping. Oh wait, crap. Um, can I launch an instance? I'm gonna have to leave the fellow. Uh, sorry, Lushire Hobbit. I need to do the instances on my own. I can see that finally England's clock changed this weekend. Yay! Let's go, let's go. All right, please, please, chat, do me a huge solid and just cross major fingers for great RNG. For great RNG, guys. Great. Huge great RNG. The bestest. I just see the Hateful Hornet. I have not once run into the Hateful Hornet this entire time. Unless it's like a tier 2, tier 3 thing only. I don't know, but like... Kind of baloney. I did do a tier 3, I think, with some people. So I don't know why we wouldn't have gotten it then. Goats, get off my bees, bro! I am gonna run and grab this flower. You're good. Okay, thank you. Thank you! I'll be back in a bit, though. Because I have to do the raid. Well, yeah, the I guess a six-man instance right after this. Alright, where'd the bees go? Oh, I lost them. They're MIA. Oh, I found them. I see them on my mini-map, which you guys can't see. Oh, there they go. Oh, a pesky pest lingers nearby. Please tell me that it is a hateful hornet. Please. 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 Dang, there's a lot of goats here. 
I really want a hateful hornet right now. Please, 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 please. Ooh, lag is really doing a freaking work today. Lag's working overtime for everybody. Please, please, please. I don't even want to look because I'm going to be upset if it's not that hateful hornet. I don't know. Okay, let's go look. <gasps> let's go! Oh my gosh! Oh my golly, dude, today is like the Spring Fest is just given to me today. It's like, Aubrey, we're gonna give you a lot of lag, but guess what? We're gonna have you find out your way of how to get the shrew deed done quick. Gonna give you the hateful hornet. Yo, what a good day. Gadget, a hateful hornet. Sounds like the criminal mastermind at a new comics company. <laughs> a new comics company. Oh man. Yeah, true. Hateful hornet. Honestly, it'll be the next like go to uh, villain against Batman. I call it in the next two years. <laughs> okay, maybe not Batman, but somebody. Oh, Ant-Man versus Wasp. Ant-Man versus Wasp. Or, or, or Ant-Man and Wasp 3. Sorry, it's not versus, but Ant-Man and Wasp 3. Hateful Hornet will be the villain. <laughs> I'm putting money on it, guys. Putting my, 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 uh, I'll put 20 bucks on it, okay? <laughs> Dude, that's so actually hilarious, though. It's sad because it could be true. Wait, should I even finish this? Well, I guess I should if I want to turn in those flowers and get that XP. Ooh, I got knocked. Got rammed. I can't believe I've never seen that hateful hornet until now. It's like a great, glorious feeling to witness. Do -do 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 -do. I like that the bees do kind of tend to wait sometimes. It is nice. Weird hydrate. Thank y'all. Give me one second. I need to give you guys more channel point redeems. I just don't know what else I want. I do want to add up like sound alerts and stuff, but it'll be a second till uh I get around to that. Woo! Thanks for the weird hydrate, Lost Shire Hobbit. Uh, ooh! Gimme, gimme. We'll nick our break our get out of here, please! We don't need you here t tampering with our flowers. I've thwarted the dangerous distraction. As a roomkeeper should. Alrighty. Boom bombing. We are just doing great today. All right, bring it on, goats. Bring it on. Y'all got nothing on me and my friends. My bee friends. They're twirling. They were twirling, trying to distract their way out of inevitably getting uh, evaporated, we'll say, by my runestones. All right, bees, let's make our way to the final staging area. Was having a drink myself, so... <laughs> Noise. Enjoy your drinks, y'all. Enjoy them. I am really craving some sparkling water right now. But I'm just too occupied playing the game to, uh, you know... Drink my water, my wawa. Apparently, so there was one day questing mom and questing dad were talking, and they were saying they were talking about coffee and how that's how they like how questing dad has this hydrate or whatever is the coffee hydrate, and people were giving them like crap for it or whatever. And then they were they were like, yeah, but wawa is like the best drink there is. And I was like, yeah, yeah, I mean, like, clearly, because, you know, water, you need to stay hydrated, you know? It is the best drink. You know, it's good for you. 
uh, but then apparently it's like a coffee place or like brand and i was like oh i thought we were actually talking about water <laughs> and i i call it wawa but like i guess wawa is a brand i was like oh <laughs> like whoopsies i uh i i guess i didn't get the memo that wawa is actually uh coffee coffee so uh yeah, so uh, I guess I have to stop saying Wawa, or I have to be more specific when I say Wawa. How many goats could there be? Oh, it's the great goat, and he looks hungry. Man, me too, man. I'm hungry too. We could go out to eat, great goat. He's been thwarted. Why do they say thwarted so much? Just say defeated. Defeated sounds like, uh, I don't know, easier. <laughs> Dan, Wawa is like a place like 7-Eleven, but a lot better. Coffee and breakfast, food, and lunch and dinner. Some have gas stations. Wait, really? It's like a it's like a 7-Eleven. I've never heard of it. Wawa. Man, I need to go to a Wawa then. I, I wonder where the closest Wawa near me could be. It's probably like miles away. Because I've never heard of it before, but it doesn't mean it's not around me, I guess. Spring leaves, let's go! Alrighty, well we did that. Uh, time for us to... I am gonna run over to the maze entrance just so we're there, but I'm gonna do the boss from the vault ones now. Let's start with tier 2 just to spice it up. Are chickens loose? No, alright, perfect. Alright, um, tier 2... Ooh, not that. Ooh. Tier two, baby, let's go. Kind of like sheets, that's a paw thing? I've never even heard of that. Sheets, you say? Hmm. Well, I'm learning a lot, that's for sure. See, when I say Wawa, I refer to water. But that's what the cool kids say now. We all say Wawa, so like, uh... <laughs> Oh, I'm being rooted? See, the trick is here, if you kill her quick enough, then you don't have to take out the other mobs. <laughs> it's funny how that works. Right, well that was tier 2, that was actually not that bad. And I was rooted. She's gonna cry about her home. They will be soon. PA, like Pennsylvania? Oh! I thought you... <laughs> I don't know why I didn't think of Pennsylvania. It's a paw thing. I said it's a paw thing. It's a Pennsylvania thing. That's right near me. Pennsylvania. I like Pennsylvania. It's cool. I like the hills in Pennsylvania. I feel like it's very, it's very like hilly forestry. Like, typed vibes. <gasps> oh, that's what you're referring to. They will be soon. The chickens. They are They are free now. Dang it. All right. Well, hold on. Let me do my tier three run. Which will take the most time, and then I can do tier one. I guess I could accept the chicken quest and then... Just wait, I guess. That's an idea. You got Waffle House? Heck yeah. I love Waffle House. Waffle House is the goat. I should go to Waffle House. I'm not gonna go to Waffle House. They're open 24 7, yeah. Okay, I actually need to like kill these mobs now though. Oh, I'm being rooted. It's okay. Just take out the mobs that way too. No, 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 no. I'm being rooted in a square. Oh, wait, I got her. Okay, that wasn't that bad. I was rooted in one of her squares, yo. Can't believe it. My home. I feel like you're in a waking nightmare. This is no dream. I was nearly consumed with anger. Order must be restored in my lands. 
Good talk, lady. Good talk. Ooh, I got a cloak! Oh. What a cloak. Please do not attack me. I don't know why they spawn like that. Alright, last one. Tier 1. Level 50. Let's go. Be so quick. Quick, easy, painless. And we're at, we should be at 35 festivity tokens. Uh, yep, we're at 35. We should make this 40. Then we're done. We never have to do this until next year. I shall take my time in turning you. Blood as noble as your feeds my power. Come, children, come forth. And let me... Uh, I don't know what she said about my blood, but... What? So, are we bouncy housing it? I don't know what's going on here. Oh my god, I'm rooted. So I can't get the chest. <laughs> it's okay, she can do her monologue. <laughs> Poor girl, she's crying. <laughs> Let me get your chest, though. Thank you. Yes, it will take time. Yes, it will. But it's okay. You will You will be fine, lady. Currency capped. Heck yeah! Let's go! We're on the currency cap, baby. I love that. I love that for us. Alright, chickens. I'm here to help you. And I'm here to annoy the- well, to take the annoying tweens out. Would you do something for me? And drink dye or beer. You know what? This sounds like a terrible mixture of things to do. Not only I have to collect chickens before they escape the maze. While I do that, I have to basically take tweens. And while I do all of this, I also have to drink oh, beers. This sounds like a very bad, poorly made choice of decisions. Well, the good news is I've I've already taken two tweens while not drunk, so that's good. But these are some poor decisions, man. Poor decisions. Ooh, I like the outfit. Uh, any beers? Ooh, a beer. Thank you for the beer. I want a chicken. Please give me a chicken. Chicken, please. Give me a chicken. Uh, Dan sounds like a brutal Aubrey night on a farm. <laughs> sounds like a horror game setup, you know? It's a horror game, yo. Oh, there's a beer. Oh, there's three beers! Holy crap! You guys need beers on Crick Hollow and the Maze on this layer. Uh, there's three beers over here. Can I drink this? No way I drink them both, though. Ah, didn't get it. It's okay. Uh, where am I? I'm right near the other beers, so that's a good sign. But I'm looking for chickens. Alright, well, I guess I'll go to the other beers then. Chicken? Nope. Alright, let's go get the beer. More beers for us. I don't see any chickens, guy. Oh! Give me. Yes. Give me the chicken. I got one. Feel better. Alright, give me this beer. Man, I'm just chugging them all. I've got my stash over here. And there's another beer over here too! Oh my golly! Alright, where did I teleport to? Oh, I'm at the exit. There's a hobbit. A lovely day. Get captured, bruh. Alright, a uh, chicken? Normally there are chickens over here. Normally the chickens aren't too far away from the exit. They're in the far back of the maze most of the time, that I've seen anyway. Yikes. Big yikes. Not running into any chickens. Alright, I guess I'll take a b another beer. I'm just like spamming this area just filled with beer. I feel like I'm cheating, but I'm just just really good at RNG, I guess. Uh oh, I'm by the entrance. Uh let's go this way. I need twin chicken! 
Chicken, 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 chicken. You're mine. Oh, let's go. All right, I just need two more beers and one more tween. And we're good to run out of here. Any beer, any beer. Any beers. Any tweens. Oh, a beer. Please have a tween just randomly run by real quick, please. Thank you. Um, nope. No tweens. Okay. It's kind of weird to be talking about tweens so much in this game. Very, very, uh, interesting, to say the least. Any beer? No. I see a tween. Oh, there's a beer right there. Please don't drink my beer. Please and thank you. I'm gonna go get this tween real quick. Oh, a chicken! Oh, there's another beer. Let's go. Wait, where's the tween? No, don't disappear! You... Oh, do you think <gasps> I got him! Wow, I should not have gotten that. That was actually risky. That should not have happened. I like this person's uh, outfit. Keeper of Mysteries. I like it. It's not like, like color wise. I don't know. It's a little. It's a little all over the place, but I like it because it is all over the place. Do, do. I want to check the comments on the video because it's been what the video has been up for Probably like three hours now typically. Okay, so I won't lie when you do post a video up on YouTube You should actually comment within that first hour because it does help the algorithm Supposedly, um, I don't have any actual evidence to show you that but what can I do for you? How can I be of service? I wouldn't put it past all right, let's run real quick with you a moment? to the quick head ma or hedge mage run. Do do gadget you said bolo drunk, drunk high elf stalking tweens in the hedge maze. Please be cautious. I mean, when you put it like that, gadget, you know I'm um I'm a bit concerned, you know. Oh crap, I'm so sorry, Lushire Hobbit. I forgot to, uh, wait, Elf Stan, I know that person. Wait, Q's on? Oh, the questing fam's on. Wait, are you not, are you not on, uh, right now, Lushire Hobbit? You might have switched. Yeah, it looks like you switched. Do, do, do. do. Just running around. All right, I want to read your guys' comments on, uh, via YouTube. And I'll read them aloud to y'all. Ooh. Level 150 Lore Master. I, I'm genuinely curious. Who has ever gotten a Lore Master to max level? Without a Valar. I'm very curious. I feel like Lore Master is just playing them for that long. Do I don't think that they're that entertaining to do for that long. Maybe I should make a Lore Master. I'll, I'll prove myself wrong. I would be grateful for your assistance. Um, okay. Well, I still got three quests to do here. Yikes. Sweet do the High Elf one. High Elf one is kind of easy. It's annoying. The maze one, the, the signs one, that one's so annoying. Big, big annoying. All right, elf number one, where you be? There you are. Don't run away from me, buddy. Come back. What do you there need? There you go. Gosh, there's so many chickens now. Oh, you're on Sissa, okay. Sissa. Oh, there you are. I must have, I must have dragged right past it. Make a Did you? Did you? Man, you have so many high-level characters, Lashire Hobbit. I'm jealous. This is like my one and only high-level. It's kind of big, sad, big, sad face. What? What do you need? All right. Uh, Gadji, so my lore master is 150 on Brandy. She took about four months and was an easy one to do. Really? Gadget, teach me the ways. Teach me the ways, buddy. I I feel like Loremasters are just so incredibly boring. 
I just, I couldn't imagine playing them for that long. Hey, I'm knocked loose. How you doing? Sub gamers, we're, we are, uh, we're, we were capturing tweens and now we are annoying, uh, high elves. Oh, we're annoying lost elves. That's what it is. I'm a high elf. I guess I'm annoying my own kind, which makes sense, but. All right, last two hobbits. Last one's really easy to get though, cause you just stand still. Uh, hello. What can I do for you? All right, last one is always gonna be in this corner, and it's so funny because it's just a person who just looking at the wall, like what I am I lost, but the wall has my answers. Like, okay, yep, I don't think it works like that, but yeah. Goldwyn must be off for bed. Hope you have a good night, stay safe. Yeah, you too, Goldwyn. Thank you for being here as always. I will see you in the next stream. Have a good night. Enjoy. Do -do -do -do. Greetings to you. All right. Oh, let's do the in league one because that one's pretty easy. Then we have the signs. Gadget, you said farm to twenty, missions to about one forty, and umbar to one fifty. Easy stuff. I thought you were gonna tell me missions. Honestly, I won't lie, I do want to make an ult and just like spam missions to death. Just be like, my goodness, missions all the time. And Lore Master might be the way to do it. Yeah, I'll have to see, um... Like, when I make an ult, there, there's, like, other... Like, this character, I just really want to... Hey, a Cicero's. A cinnamon roll! I love cinnamon roll. Cinnamon roll so friggin' adorable. Um, but yeah, I think with the next ult... Like, this ult, I... Well, with this character, my main right now. I told y'all that I want to get through the main story quest, every single one, through her. Which is what we've done. Um... I think next, oh, I want to explore regions that I haven't really been around. Is that person cheating? There's no way you can run that fast. Oh wait, you can actually run fast in the maze. Never mind. There's no, there's no debuffs. Um, yeah. So I think next, oh, maybe we go to regions we haven't been to and do like side quests there. Um, like the angle. I would like to do Yondshire again because I've only done it once. Wildwood. I think like areas I've never tried. And then yeah, I do want to make an ult that's like strictly just missions. <laughs> like that's it. <laughs> I feel like that could be so bad, but so good. I'm not Lucy said, I really want to get into Lotro. I've never played it properly, just really daunting to start with. I watch a lot of streams. I basically just play WoW all day, every day. Ooh, that's fair. I hear WoW is pretty like uh How do you do? pretty intoxicating we'll say i guess like it's it's very Holy easy to fall in the rabbit friend. hole <laughs> yeah i mean honestly i'm not loose like there's nothing nothing says that you have to really get into lotro like there are just some games that i love to watch and i never play lethal company being one of them phasmophobia i have played but i don't like playing phasmophobia but i love watching other people play it so you know i, I mean there's nothing wrong with that if you feel like that is the case um yeah, if you do feel like you've never played Lotro properly, like, I don't know, what makes you think like you haven't, I guess. Gadget, my only class recommendation is ranged, of course. Melee like, takes a bit longer because you always have to uh, be close with enemies to kill them, and that takes a tad bit longer. That is true. Yeah, melee classes are something. I'm in a very melee mood lately, though. I don't know why I am. I really don't know why I'm in a melee mood, guys. I, like, my next ult, I guarantee you, if I'm still in this vibe, which I feel like I will be by the time we hit max on a room keeper here, I have a big feeling that I will be making a melee ult. I was thinking champion, but I'm really not in the best phases with champion right now. Brawler is a big one I'm thinking about. Um... Guardian, I feel like if I want to torture myself, I guess I could do Guardian. Captain, I'm not opposed by either. I've actually kind of been enjoying the Dwarf Captain I have with Coffee and Jewels. I'm just really not feeling ranged lately. 
I'm not really feeling like minis are pretty okay, like pretty okay still, but I'm not really feeling hunters, lore masters, like none of that lately. I don't know what's wrong with me. Maybe my next salt will be a warden. <laughs> All right, I don't want to get your guys' ropes up now, okay? <laughs> Maybe I should have. I shouldn't say that. But, I mean, I do have my ward and I'll... I don't know if I'll keep her, though. I don't know. She did, all, like, all the postman, like, quests, all the postmaster quests and stuff, though, so... Maybe I will. Maybe I will. But, yeah, I just like to do stuff on the next salt. Like, it doesn't have to be main story quests, though. I just... I would like to take more of a relax vibes i guess and do like more side missions more side i guess not missions but side quests lag lag a lag a lag oh lag is really hitting me i don't know about y'all what the heck you guys okay My whole, like, internet is just saying, nah. Okay, phew. I don't know why it wasn't pulling up Twitch for me. Because I was trying to load in my bitrate. It's loading so slow. It's okay, though. Yeah, I was trying to pull up my bitrate, and it wasn't showing anything. Um, well, Shari said, Sissa dinged level 120 after completing that instance in the Glimmer Deep. Ellie is 100. Yoara is 86. And then your other is 65. Frithland is about to hit 30. Carolyn is 24-ish. Nice. Yeah, I got um I have a lot of ults, but I just wanna I wanna strictly with this account on this stream account, I just wanna strictly do one character and just stick with one. Like having multiple ults, I feel overwhelms me. I basically have the ones I have now for crafting bank and just for me to play with other people but i don't really intend to like keep these characters long i guess is the thing um all right i think we've done all of spring fest wait come here I'll slap him with my fish to make him move quicker. Move quicker. Move quicker, Gansra. Chop, chop. Hurry up. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. I give you a hug. I'm sorry. I'm a, I'm a rude friend. You're <laughs> literally, literally horrified by my fish slapping. Oh, now he wants to- okay, yeah, I bow before we- yeah. <laughs> Gosh. Oh my golly. Alright, well, I don't know what to do now. We're only at three hours of stream? What do you guys want to do? Should we do some main story quests? I didn't plan to, but I feel like this is too short of a stream. Can I do for you? Not okay with the 200... Oh God, 200 leaves. I have all the cosmetic pets. Oh, no, I'm missing one more. There we go. All right, we have all of the cosmetic pets for the spring festival, so we're good there. Um. Oh, Dan, you said, hey, I asked before about a comp tune, but I got a phone call, didn't hear you reply, ever consider it. What do you mean by like a comp tune? Cause I was confused by that. Maybe I should get like the, I'll get the saddle. I'll get stuff for my war steed, why not? What else am I gonna buy this stuff on, huh? Ooh, that teapot looking mighty cozy, though. I want that in signpost, though. Give me that. I'll get the teapot. Why not? It looks cute. Um... I don't really see anything. What's the spring festival theme? Yeah, I don't really see anything worth getting. Wait, I'll get a Moria keg. I'm missing a keg in my apartment. In my apartment. I'm missing a keg right now in my, uh... Oh, we should get some maps! Because this is a deed! Might as well, YOLO. 
I don't think I started the deed. Yep, here we go. Map of our chat. Uh, I've been numinous, any Bree Town, and Old Forest. There we go. We at least started it. Are there more? No. Uh, completion tune. Oh, completion tune. Ooh, no, I will never consider that. Never, ever, ever doing a completion tune. Even though I'm acting like this is a completion tune for whatever reason, but. Um, yeah, I want to consider it <laughs> because that would just take me years to get through. And I feel like this character took me too long to get through as it is. And uh, maybe, maybe in like my 50s, I'll consider it. I'm 50 years old, living the dream. All right, is there anything I want from the Spring Fest? I mean, I don't really have space to get like outfits, but assortment of dwarf candles. Dark purple dye seems cute though. You know what? I'll buy dyes yellow. F it. I'll put them in the shared storage. All right. Uh, I think I'm just gonna save the rest. Oh, I should have. I should have bought more consumables. Shoulda. I shoulda. All right. Well. Hey, that's okay. All right. Uh, well, it's okay. Yeah, we still got we still got more things to do. Uh, tomorrow. Okay. Um. Mm -mm. Uh, anyone want a dusty shrew? I keep getting dusty shrews. Anyone need a dusty shrew for their tomb? Poorly made decisions. Hey, been missing your streams lately. We played the first day of the festival to get the slug pet. Then put all your time into Lethal Company. Uh. Oh, put all your time into Lethal Company. Hope you're doing well. Yeah, I hope you're doing well too. Dude, Lethal Company is a blast though. No lie, I don't blame you. All right, um, let me, I'm gonna travel to my house real quick so I can drop off some of this stuff. I didn't realize my crafting carry all is filled. Oh, that's why. Get that out of there. We don't need that. Um. Yeah, if anyone on Crick Hollow wants a Dusty Shrew, feel free. Otherwise, it's going in my shared storage. Because now I actually have space for it. Ooh. Um. Do... I don't know. What else did I say I was going to put in my shared storage? Oh, the dyes. That's right. Um, do 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 Questing out there. Um, <laughs> I have to run away from Ganteron now. An old warden. I mean, I do have my old warden already. Oh, maybe that's what we should do. I did get some um, quests to turn in during our walk to Mordor. Maybe I just do that so I can get some stuff. Maybe we even collect pages. We could collect pages. Yeah, maybe that's what we do. We just do some housekeeping stuff. Stuff that doesn't necessarily need to get done, but knowing me, I just want to get it done. <laughs> See, I, I sit here and tell you, Dan, I don't want to make a completionist tune, and here I am like, oh, let me do these gray level quests, because why not? I have them, and I need to complete them. Do my shield maiden, she was stretching, and then she saw me approaching, she was like, oh crap, I gotta sit up straight. <laughs> Gadget, you probably have room to throw a few tweens in the shared storage. Listen. <laughs> but we don't talk about the tweens. I mean, what tweens? I never never saw any tweens. Alright, well, let me change this one. Because I don't like the above weather top. Like, the above weather top painting so old-fashioned now. What about a numinous? That one's cute. Bree Town's always a cutie. I love Bree Town. Our chat's always a cutie, too. Old forest? Nah. The old forest one I'm getting rid of. Quite easily. 
Um, all right, Moria keg. I don't think I have a Moria keg. Actually, let's drink from the Moria keg, y'all. This one is fun. I like when it teleports you to places in Moria. Um, also, do I have another wall? I do! Perfect. Wait, this is furniture yard or mobile yard? Wait, what? Oh, this is furniture. Oh, it's not a wall object? Dang it! Oh, I think all my furniture is taken up. Uh, uh... Oof, I want that bar stool. Oh, we could get rid of the armchair. That's not too important, I'll say. Dude, oh my god, this thing is massive. Um... I didn't realize how massive this thing was. Um... Okay, um... I mean, this is, this is our little bar area, so, I mean, better make the most of it, right? Alright, that's close enough. That's good. Uh, my poor armchair. Uh, my teapot needs to go somewhere. I guess I could put my armchair somewhere else, right? Teapot? It's a little cozy teapot! That's so cute! Uh, pick that up, though. Uh, I guess I could put the armchair here? House decorating stream? And what if I put the teapot, like, on a chair? Wouldn't that be hilarious? <laughs> I can line this up right. Da -da 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 -da. Uh, it's like just a little too high. Hmm. Alright. Give it. I was gonna put it on the coffee table. Dang! Uh, alright. Well, the teapot's gonna go in storage. Did do. Alright. Welcome to my humble abode. I love this Ambari bed. It's so pretty. I think it's one of the best beds I've seen yet. Yeah, look at all of our kegs, yo. Dude, our bar area looks so sweet. Uh, I actually really like this room a lot. I I feel like this is the room I'm trying to put like the most energy in. And I think it shows. Like it's just kind of cozy, but like the it I don't know. It feels like a I feel like this is like a drinking room for sure. And out here is just something. It's just whatever I found along the way. My journeys and my bedroom is so vacant because I'm never there because I'm too busy journeying out, you know? Uh, teapot, uh, newness, and Breetown, and Old Forest goes bye bye. Don't want that. Don't want that. Um, gosh, I'm gonna have maps in here. Actually, I could use that map. Thank you. Do I have an above weather top map? Oh my god, get it out of here! I don't need that many weather top paintings, and I can get plenty more. Where that came from? All right, Mario Keg, let's go. You guys, ready? I'm excited. <laughs> this keg can only be used if a player has access to Mario. Wait, where's the table? We gotta dance on it. Hey, we're going to Boria. Hey, oh, let's go. They're taking the hobbits to Moria. <laughs> That's how the song goes, right? All right, where are we going? Oh, oh my golly. This is the first person perspective of you wake up and you've had too much. Oh, I know exactly where we are. Oh, <laughs> I've actually never landed here. Wait, how can we actually like not? Are we able to live by jumping this or not? Because some places on the keg, on the Moria keg, they will they will kill you. Oh my gosh, you could actually jump that. Wow, that was that was actually not a bad one. 
Flaming Deeps, we are in the- we're real close to them, but we're in the Red Horn loads. So, far south-ish. Not too bad, not too bad though. Alright, that wasn't too bad! That was cool. Uh, I'm gonna go to... Indigoeth, because I think that's where these gray quests are at. Wait, we should do the further adventures of Bilbo Baggins. Because I want those cosmetic pets. And I haven't- I haven't ever completed it all the way through. Plus there's virtue XP, heck yeah. Nars Peak, man, I forgot this is Nars Peak. I thought this was Nars Peak. This is so far upward. Look at how far out the map we are. That's so wild to me. Okay, let me get my quest guide up. Yeah, so the one we need is down here at the old way. Uh, honestly, we might just ride the whole way there. Um. Oh wow, that's at the scout camp. Yeah, I just- I don't know, I'm trying to make sure that my quest don't get totally overflowed. My quest log. Should I do allegiances? I think we should do that too. I won't do that today, but... Yeah, I'm just trying to make sure our quest log doesn't get overrun, I guess. Reputation quest, that's important. Veils! I do need to go to the veils. Oof. Alright, I'm trying to sober up for you guys. Look at this glorious view. <laughs> We're too drunk to even enjoy the view. Uh, let me update uh, the stream title. Bilbo's Adventures More Upkeep and Random Quests. Oop, there we go. Gants run, late reply, but make sure you reach your quota. Heck yeah! Hit the quota! Hit the quota, y'all! I better get it! Man, I'm getting tired. Do my arms hurt from all the frosting of the cakes I did earlier? I was like, going crazy on them. Yes, that's how that's how the like uh, frosting thing goes. It's like that's not at all how it sounds like when it comes out. But <laughs> all right, let me read um, let me read some of the YouTube comments on the new video. I'm a little um, nervous. I will not lie. Wow, 125 views already. Three hours, nice. Um. 19 likes, looking good, looking shenaggy. Why can't I find the freaking comment section? What the freak? Fine, I'll just go on my end. I'm sorry. Six comments. Wow, no dislikes. People must like that I'm turning a new leaf. So, uh, okay, so the first comment I see says, I haven't paid Lotro since 2012. Yeah, I am watching this. <laughs> I'm just gonna say as you should, but honestly, play the game. It's fun and still is getting regular updates. Now look at how pretty it is. That's so gorgeous. Um. Aw, Gary, great job on warning video. I always like playing a mind and learning new gambits. Keep up the great work. Aww. Aw, digs, Gary. Uh, 
Uh, Mai said, Hobbit Wardy is the way to go. Oh yeah, that's what he told me um, in chat earlier. Because the racial faint scale for Hobbits, it is kind of impressive. Um, I didn't consider the faint skill for Hobbits. Thank you. Good reminder. I don't even think I got that far on my Warden alt. Um, someone, oh, Sela said, I'm proud of you, warden class, best class. I'm just gonna say dot, dot, dot. I don't know about best class, <laughs> but it's fun to some extent. I can't give everybody, I, I can't, I can't admit the whole truth now. Uh, all right, so the, the, tip I got here, blue spec makes max difficulty much more manageable instead of red's penalty to some of the healing gambits, you get more avoidance, more mitigations and much better self-healing you will do less damage of course, but survivability trumps damage output at high landscape settings mm -hmm. oh my gosh, someone actually went in very detail, oh my god, this is a long comment There's a great plugin on the screen for Warden Ease. Everybody, I get so bummed out when people talk about the Warden plugin. Like, Oh, well, there's this plugin. Like, I guess some people want to be, like, you know, helpful and point it out, which is good. But then sometimes it's like, oh, well, Aubrey, just use the plugin. And I'm like, you're missing the point. I don't feel like I should need to use the plugin. The fact, it's just like this. To me, it's like the fact that there needs to be a plugin for people to naturally understand the class, there's something wrong. And the fact that most people aren't going to go out of their way to do a plugin, I think that just is a sign that there's something amiss that needs to be fixed. And that's kind of why I don't want to do a plugin because I'm like, if I do a plugin, I'm almost excusing it, excusing the difficultness of warden gambits and stuff. And I don't, I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't want to do that. But anyway, that's just my opinion. So everybody's like, but the plugin, Aubrey, the plugin. And I think that person was just mentioning the plugin to be nice. To be like, oh yeah, just by the way, for people to know, which is really, really good. Lotropad is great. I don't know that. Lotropad. What if I just fell? It'd be quicker to get off the mountain if I just fell. Hey, Sneak, how's it going? Or you said for three seconds, I thought you were flying. <laughs> Almost. Woo. <laughs> I'm a witch. I'm a witch. I'm just flying. Bewitched. <laughs> oh, my. Close enough. I got my little broomstick, my little Yol, uh, my Yol hobby horse stick. All right, where are we going? I forgot where I said I wanted to go. Uh, oh, I have a tell. Ooh. Chickens, lol. I did not know the Moria keg did that. Yeah. Yeah, the Moria keg's really cool because I really enjoy it because you can end up in like the most craziest of areas. My favorite place to end up is actually on... Um, it's in... Uh, what's that one area in Moria? Yeah, it's in the Foundation of Stone. It's that very tip-top thing you see right there. Very tip-top of this you can actually spawn on. There's no way down. Like, you have to die. <laughs> so you end up there and you just insta-die. I mean, pretty much. It's kind of it's kind of bonkers, but I love it for that reason. It's just I don't know. It's it's interesting. There is a bar above the twenty-first hall. Wait, really? 
There's a bar? Above it? Danny, so Lentropad is like notepad you can access on all tunes. Take notes about what areas you're in, to-do list, what tunes are, what crafts. Yeah. Yeah, man. So I saw Sweltorista. Sweltorista, um, she has... I went on her one of her past VODs on a stream. And she legit has like a whole spreadsheet and it has like everything labeled out. I think I should make a spreadsheet. Because I will forget the more I keep adding alts and stuff. I think that'd be helpful. Like right now I do have something of the sort, Dan, on my phone that pulls up my characters, like typically like what level they are, like craft wise, like it's mostly for crafting sake, like what they are and what they do and what like what their highest like grade level is for crafting. But other than that, I don't really keep like the other stuff altogether. Whoop. You get there from the keg? Wait, really? You can get there from the keg? No way, I gotta find this out. I gotta figure this out. Sneak, I wanna see it. Like Arthur, you said, so you don't like using plugins, but you keep track of stuff on your phone. Hmm, yes, correct. Because it's as simple as I pull up my phone and I type my crafting stuff. Well, I don't know what else to do. Like, I guess you could lose Lotropad, which I never knew about until right now. But, I mean, what else would I do? Gotta take notes somehow, right? Uh, alright, here we go. Here you go, sir. Just clearing this out of my quest log. No, I'm not doing any of your quests. Get away from me, bruh. Seek, if you go to a respawn circle and look up, it's in that area. Ooh. Huh, I did not know that. Is it not accessible any other way? I didn't know that. Oh, the Mordor walk. Lotroshire, heard about that. Yo, Garther, I'm a plug-in programmer, so the reasoning confuses me. <laughs> or confounds me. I get you. It makes sense to me, man. No, I mean, like... The plugin. This is the thing about a plugin. I'm gonna have to take time to install something. I don't want to do all that. And then I'm gonna have to mess with my game files. And I just don't want to do all that. I'm more worried about messing up my game files by putting in a plugin or doing whatever. Then I just prefer to just do something simple like that in my opinion nope it's not accessible unless you do wow okay the answer on the warden video has given me a fresh perspective on the class maybe i'll give it a go now wait really have i converted you now ganser <laughs> gonna join use the com com compendium click and add very simple you just click and add like what do you mean you just click and add you just paste a link or something? Did you? I'm just trying to get to my quest, sirs. The dead has risen. Lotro plugin compendium is a plugin manager. Just click to add, delete, updated. That's it. Well, how do you get the plugin manager? Is it just the uh, the one that's uh not there? Where is it? Is it just this? Load. Install it like any desktop app. Oh, okay. To be honest with the plugin, it made it super duper easy. It's like a library where you can just tick the box of what you want. Oh, okay. All right, that's tempting. I already play a warden. That's why I, oh, I see. I see you were just, you were just playing with me. I, I didn't. I didn't actually influence you at all to uh, try it out again. 
I see Gantron. It's fine. Can I put in a link? Yeah, sure. Wait, what? Aubrey with a plug-in? What the heck? I don't have a plug-in. Hi, okay. Don't get your hopes up. I'll try it on my main account. Maybe. Lotro interface, yeah. Do web shot. Um. Not sure where prerequisites to a quest chain are. Looking for direction on a quest that is eluding you. Man, that's so crazy that it could actually. It could actually tell you what the prereqs to a quest chain are. That's kind of cool. What are you up to, Aubrey? I've been on and off and I have I have so much homework. No, not the homework. Crap, I have so much homework. Oh, man. You reminded me I have homework to do, too. I haven't really looked at my assignments this week, which is bad. The video was very good. If I didn't already play Warden, I would most certainly be giving it a go now. Aw, uh, thanks, Gatsurad. I didn't realize- wait, I didn't realize- is that- it, it, is that what your character is that I always have him running by? No, he's a captain. I didn't realize you had a warden, Ganton. Oh my gosh, guys. I just looked at my friends list and I was like, I didn't see a single warden icon. There's two wardens on my friends list, yo! <laughs> two wardens. Runekeepers, mariners, lots of minis, lore masters, lots of hunters. Guardians, Captains, Champions, Burglars, Brawlers, Bjornings. I feel like there's still a class missing. I don't know. That's so funny. <laughs> Two Wardens. <laughs> more on plug-in. I use a travel window. So I have more action slots on my screen for pets mounts and a vitals plug-in, which looks very nice. Yeah, I've seen the Vitals one. Brawlers? Yeah, I had a few Brawlers on there. Alright, we got that one done. Easy peasy. Getting deeds started. Agarthur said you need to add some so you can say some of my best friends are wardens because that's not condescending at all. <laughs> I need to add some. I'll get right on it, man. Oh man, it's just so funny. I was just like, wait, I don't have any friends that are wardens. <laughs> All my friends are hunters, it looks like, which I mean makes sense. Runekeeper, there's actually quite a few runekeepers. I wonder if runekeeper is like making a comeback. Well, I don't know. There seems to be a lot more minis on my friends list anyway. It's very just general from my friends list. But dude, the hunters are massively crazy. They've popped off real bad. Two burglars though, so. <laughs> Lost Shire Hobby, you're one of them. <laughs> one of them. Yeah, there's actually kind of few, uh, quite a few brawlers. One of them's mine, though, so I guess it only counts for so much. Uh, Alright, let's get to the main area and turn in this other quest. Um, After we turn that in, just to turn it in, Um, I would then... Um, I'm just gonna cancel that. Um, after that, we could do the Bilbo, the further adventures of Bilbo. Dan, you say, yay, finishing deeds. I don't want a comp tune, lol. I'm not even finishing deeds. I'm just, I'm, I'm clearing out my quest. I know, Dan, I know. I don't know what I want. I just wanna, I wanna, I want a nice looking... I want a nice looking rune keeper with a good amount of Oh, that looks so pretty. Didn't even notice that on the walk. I just want a nice looking rune keeper, you know, and more space in my quest log because all these stupid freaking lost lore quests I've picked up that I just don't want to let go of for whatever reason. They're keeping up so much space in my quest logs and I just wanted to get my completed out of the way. Like these north ones have to go. 
these north down ones. But then it's also like, it's gonna help the rep that I have with these people if I do them, and then also deeds, so yeah. You know? You have a level 63 warden on Gladden. Oh, okay, that makes sense. Because I'm like, I don't, I don't, I, I don't know you on Gladden, Ganseron, you know? We're strangers on Gladden. Alrighty. Goltrev. I love Dunlin so much. It's so much fun, y'all. It's so enjoyable! I do. I guess I could do some deeds. If we really wanted to make the stream interesting, we could just <laughs> do our Shire deeds. You know? You know, you know? I do need some routes to fulfill and some pies to destroy. <laughs> hey Muffin Hoppin, how you doing? Oh, that's a mission recruiter. Greetings. Will you remain da, here da, long? Da, 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 da. Uh no, I will not remain here long. I just want to go to the scout camp. Da, 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 okay. Yeah, after this we'll do Bilbo's adventures. What time is it? Oh my gosh, it's 10 o'clock, bro. How does this happen? The day just flies by. I am getting a bit tired. So I don't know how many chapters we'll do of the Please. Further's Adventures of Bilbo, but... All right, what gives me the most coin? An axe. Yay. See, look at that rep. Rep increase, let's go. All right, um, I need to get to Trollshaws. What's the best way to get there? Really, none of these are the best way, so we'll just do that. Uh, Toadster, how you doing? Hello, hello. Muffin Hobbit, you said it's going. We actually just moved into our new house. Oh, nice. That's so exciting. I hope it's marvelous. Man, moving moving has to be exhausting though. How you feeling after the move? Toadster, you said how you how you dude? How am I doing? How's the Lotro wing? Uh Lotro's got good. We got Springfest. We got our I think we got majority of the deeds done for Springfest that we could do. Um we had a lot of spring leaves. Uh how do I get out of this? There we go. Uh we got our festivities token capped now for the next fest um hello wannabe besties i don't know who you are <laughs> um but anyway uh yeah so i got my festivity tokens capped which is good because then we can save it for the next uh event or the next festival uh we did have a lot of spring leaves i did spend a lot of them just on whatever floated my boat and now to because i kind of want to stream a little bit longer uh i do want to do the further adventures nice let's go heck yeah how you been toadster how's little throwing been for you uh i thought the name would have been a dead giveaway gan villain what can i do uh, uh, ganteron maybe <laughs> Can't be you, Ganteron. <laughs> I don't read. I didn't read the name. Okay, Muffin. You said we are so tired. We didn't take any work off. So it's mostly been little, little things after work. We did the big stuff Sunday. Oh man. Oh, Muffin, good luck. You're gonna be so exhausted. I hope you're doing all right. Muffin, you said I took a two-hour nap after dinner. <laughs> yeah, I don't blame you. Yeah, I took a two-hour nap today, too. I was so tired after work. I was like, oh. <laughs> can't turn around, can't it? <laughs> I didn't realize. Okay, I was like, who is this? You know, like, what the... What do they want? All right, let's do this uh, further adventure. I haven't done this in so long. I'm literally in my bare feet in the snow, guys. 
Oh, golly. Yeah, bring it on. Come here. Come here, you goblins. Wow, they're actually kind of hefty, though. I should turn on landscape difficulty because I do want the emotes for this character. Toadster, you said, just got to Tom. Bob did last night. Moving slowly but steady. Heck yeah. Let's go to Tom Bombadil. So sweet. I love him. The wargs will get him. Don't worry about that. Who said that? Come at me, bruh. What wargs? What wargs? Oh my gosh, there's three of them. Wow. Mass execution. You know what? Let's just run and grab them all. YOLO. Actual YOLO, though. Oh, come here, goblins. Come here. Uh oh, I'm rooted. I'm actually rooted, though. I messed up. I done messed up real bad. <laughs> I just hear that they keep getting, like, knocked over or whatever. They keep getting stunned. Wow, we actually saved that. Dude, that was crazy. There should be a designated nap time for every day. Right, Muffin! Yes! I agree with the statement a thousand and ten percent. I never- I always hated naps, but man, like, ever since I basically, like, get, like, four hours of sleep on average, I'm like, I actually need to start setting aside time for napping throughout my day. Like, I'm so excited because I get to sleep in tomorrow. You guys, I'm probably gonna sleep, like, a good 12 hours tonight. A good 12 hours. Like, easy. I feel like I've just been working nonstop. And I'm just tired of working. It's, it's getting to me. Getting burnt out. Burnt out on the working. I need, like, a week off. And then I'll be set. Oh! Oh, golly! There's, like, nothing but dead wargs here. Playing goblins. Oh. What happened? Are you looking for the halfling? You're too late. My wargs found him. He should belong to me, but look. They squabbled over the spoils, claimed the halfling for themselves. Uh, oh, I demand to know where Bilbo was taken, and he just says no, and dies laughing. What a douche. Oh, a mission reward, woo. Yes, give me my tokens, please. No W's, Rob! Today was my sleeping day, heck yeah, Gantz Rob. Wait! Are you past the 10 days already of working straight in a row or not, Gantron? What day is this? I'm asking for a friend. Alright, three minutes. No W's in the chat. My timer has been started. How you doing today, Rob? Oh, I don't want to do chapter one. I guess we'll do chapter six, yeah? We probably need to repeat these for how many tokens we need for those cosmetic pets, right? Find your way into Pinath Fenwy and clear it of goblins. Only then will it be safe to confront the goblin leader about Man, I've only been hobbits. up here one time and I really... I got destroyed when I was up here in the Misties. I'm just running, like, straight backwards and just aggroing everything. It works. Barry said I'm losing hours of sleep during night because my little doggo wants to sleep with me every single night. Dude, that's- I have the opposite. My cat loves to start stuff up at night, and I always wake up to her always smacking things off of my computer. She's just totally just sitting her little butt on my keyboard, and I hear the keys go crazy, like... 
Oh, she gets in so much trouble. I can never sleep. Where's a where in Lotro is no W's the worst? I don't know. Oh, were we lagging or I'm stuck. Okay, my character's finally moving. Uh, I don't know. I would say um landscape difficulty, no W's, that hurts the most. Not really a place, but hurts the most on landscape. I would say Dan. Yeah, it's I forgot Easter was a thing, so I got today off. I still have to work Saturday and Sunday. Oh, man. But I get Monday and Tuesday off, too, only because of Easter. Nice, though. See, that's why I've been working so much this week. It's because of Easter. But it'll be... Monday at work will be really tough because we'll be, like, so out of everything. And then the whole morning, I'll just be, like, stressing to get everything up back to back to normal rob you said uh you can't use the w key because no u this is a mistake wait what i can't use the u key i don't use the uk The W key. <laughs> Unless you're saying two U's for a W, which makes sense. <laughs> Timer done. Na, 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 na. I guess I could work around that way, just have two U's act as uh, the W. <laughs> Switching characters again. I might be leveling a new character somewhere. Ooh, nice. Why no double U? You in chat again reminds me. I don't know. It's participating in the no W way you were. Nice. Heck yeah. No W's for the win. Couldn't figure out how to type it. Oh. Okay, that makes sense. That makes sense. Don't use that letter. <laughs> Are we gonna have to ban letters now, chat? Come on. <laughs> Be nice now. <laughs> Don't ban letters now. <laughs> Don't make me ban letters, guys. Da -da, da -da. I saw that there was an emote there and I didn't even see the emote. Can't use skills, Ganto! How dare you! I'll, uh, I'll redeem it when I'm in combat. Makes more sense that way. Uh, Dan, you said you were looking for new point redemptions. That's true. Oh, there was one I had. Oh, I had a point redemption idea that, uh, I guess it doesn't work anymore. Maybe I should change it to Hunter. But I'll be like, all right, point redemption, and I'll go on m my, uh, I'll go on a Lotro class I absolutely dislike for five minutes. <laughs> I'll play it for five minutes. Make me suffer. A Garth or no W. Might have trouble with the woos are wed quest. Not to mention the wide of woe and we <laughs> Oh my gosh. That's crazy, man. That's crazy. Um how many tokens we got? We got 51. Man, we might have to do the repeatables right now. We probably should, honestly. I just really want those dang cosmetic pets, man. I want them. Uh, how many chapters are there? We have to get through chapter 10. Probably do that. You will need a distraction if you are to rescue Bilbo from Goblin Town. Bilbo's in Goblin survive. Town. Rare Rose Gondor ran the restful fell. <laughs> Rare Rose Gondor ran Resh Road fell. <laughs> oh, is he actually gonna help me fight? Stay close to me. Don't let them see you. It's a stealthy, stealthy quest. The goblins wrecked this campsite. <laughs> I love how he says perfect. Why is that good for us? It means they will not check here again. That's true. <laughs> Be doing their things. 
All right, I must hide. I will hide here. Don't come out until after I've led them away, all right? Uh, where should I hide? I guess I'll just hide here. I'll hide behind the tent. Why not? You remember which rock it's under? Which rock it's under? No? No, then? I don't know. Hey, goblins! Get him! Who's that? Lee! Oh, is this like a searching quest? Is that what you're saying? Oh, oh, golly. Yeah, I've never actually done this, so I have no idea which one. I'm gonna guess it's closer to Goblin Town. Oh, you'll see it. <laughs> You're not wrong. If I get a first try, that would Oh, fudge. No, get away from me! Oh my god, there's so many. Wait, suspicious rocks. Okay, well, I'm gonna assume it's under a rock for sure. Because you said rock and not snow pile. I am dying though. Oh wait, I can't use skills. What am I doing here? Okay, okay. Next one, Gantaron. Next one. I'm so sorry. I totally forgot. Okay, next one. Okay, okay. I'm gonna search this rock now, okay? Okay. If you save the goblin in the previous chapter, he'll tell you what rock the key is under. <laughs> I didn't know that! Whoa! Whoa! Damn! <laughs> this is what I get for not paying attention. Okay. Because <laughs> I was wondering what that what that thing was. Like, oh, I had an email for him. Yep, did you save him? No, I, I annihilated his butt. I didn't even know there was a choice to save him. Shame, shame. I know, I'm sorry. A crack rock, you say, bar? Alright, 30 seconds and go. And I'll leave it a little longer because I am searching for like 30 some seconds. So, All right, bring it on. <laughs> Where are we at? We're at 17 seconds already. Dang. All right, I'll give you an extra however many. I'll give you an extra 13 seconds. What's the timer set? I'm probably going to die. 10, 9, 8, dead. <laughs> Gantara killed me! How oh, damn. Okay, we're at 9, uh, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Get annihilated. Or I get stunned, one of the two. I'm actually in pain. They're all a running. I'm alright with that. Run! Run for this, run! Alright. You said I'll probably die, and I was like, how? Oh, well, no skill. <laughs> yep. Your no skills do, do be killing. Alright, well, we search those two. Nothing. Uh, what are the odds it's that one, though? I don't know. This one looks suspicious. They're attacking my rune stone, bro. <laughs> That's stunned, man. Okay, I want to save this goblin. But knowing me, I wouldn't have even paid attention to when he said where the key was, so I guess it's all right. It was bound to happen this way. All right, well, I did that rock. Uh, maybe this one? <laughs> you know what? I'm just gonna search them all. F it. F it all! <laughs> I'm gonna just search them all! <laughs> Try the other rock. <laughs> Yo, Gantara, what do you think I've been doing here? I've been trying all the rocks. <laughs> all of them. I mean, if he were to tell you which rock it would be, wouldn't it be more likely to be a rock that stood on its own, like this one? 
Yeah? Nope. That just made too much sense, I guess. Try this one. Oh. God, why do they actually do, like, really good damage? I feel like I'm playing landscape difficulty or something. I don't think I checked that rock officially. <gasps> I have it! Oh my golly. It was like the rock, like... Is this water or is this like a cliff? I can't tell if that's water or cliff. All of them. Good thing she can use the skill now. skills now, that's true. If you find it under the last rock, I'll be very impressed. <laughs> All right, come here. I led them on a merry chase. They'll, they'll help you some time returning. All right. Man, that mission could be so quick if you knew exactly which rock it was under. Chapter 8. Close the gates that lead further oh. into Goblin Town, or you will be overrun before you can rescue Bilbo. Close the gates, it says? Do not fall down to the lower level. Okay. So I want to stay up top, I guess? Oh! Oh my god, that was terrifying. Holy crap, that's a lot of goblins. Oh, here they come. You better not push me, or I swear. Stop stunning me, you douchebags! Where are the other gates? Oh, here we go. Uh oh. All right. Uh, talk to the guardian of the jails. Oh, here he is. Don't push me because I'm close to the edge. A little sorry. Good throw back. <laughs> Weird hydrant. Jump in and find out, you say gadget. Oh my golly. Don't tell me now. That's my job. I think you're you're saving your friend. You're more stupid than you look. No one escapes from Goblin Town. Buddy, I do, though. <laughs> Woo! Thanks for the weird hydra gadget! No one! Seven streams! Let's go! Slowly getting the number back up. Hope your stream's going well. Yeah! Thanks, no one. Yeah, we're doing some uh, further adventures of Bilbo right now. Because I want those cosmetic pets and I'm trying to get tokens. <sighs> I guess these will have to be like daily things to do. But I've actually never completed all ten chapters. Find Bilbo and free him. I will. I will find my Bilbo. My Bilbo sad, 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 sagans. <laughs> sad, sad, sagans is his name. Wow. Taking out, like, multiple enemies. Bilbo! What you doing, Bilbo? I won't take anything like that, I assure you. Oh, it won't take anything like that, I assure you. What would you like to know? Boss, someone's here. Yeah, I'm right here. Oh, he knows me. Bilbo knows me. We're famous. You're a friend of this little rat. Why, yes. Yes, I am. Won't power any underlings who are near. There will be no need for the torture pit. He'll squeak for us when you die. Kill the high elf. 
Yeah, come and get me, bros. Your goblins just suck, okay? I've literally gone through this entire goblin town undetected, mostly. If detected, I was not overruled. Not overrun at all. You need more warriors? Uh, well. Kill the high elf. I'll get help boss stay here. <laughs> okay. Yeah, good luck. Anyway. Where's Golem? I'll be safe here. <laughs> You're gonna be sorry. He literally trapped himself in a jail cell so he wouldn't have to fight me. Yuri will easily defeat your throng. Quiet, rat. They will be here any second now. Yeah, we can keep waiting. I got all day. Bah! I'll deal with you myself. Yeah, you so say. Big mistake, bro. Even Bilbo's like, I wouldn't even do that if I were you. Bilbo's trying to help the enemy. <laughs> well done. It's a good thing, too, for I will be most pleased ever to see the torture pits of which he spoke. I missed them on my first venture in a gond uh, goblin town, and I'm in no hurry to see them on my visit. <laughs> All right, sir. Totally forgot about the chest. Better throng of goblins than a goblin thong. I know, I was like, thong. I kept seeing thong. <laughs> I was like, that seems wrong. All right, this is the final chapter. Let us hope you can bring Bilbo safely through Goblin Town without incident. Oh, I didn't realize he's classified as mission. Oh golly, it does say mission. Oh golly, oh golly. I'm gonna be level one twenty-five, guys. All right, let's help uh, Bilbo save. God, look at that man's health. Uh, man, he don't need me. I need him! He's immune to stuns and dazes to- And fear. Oh my god. Bilbo, you're like a tank and I'm protecting you? No one used the time to learn mounted combat now that Langhold is destroyed? Heck yeah. You don't want to see goblins in a thong. Some things can't be unseen. Yeah, I'm good on that too, Agarthur. I'm gonna skip on the goblin thongs. Frodo has more use for Sting now than I have, poor lad. Are we talking the common term for thong or Australian thong? What's the difference? I'm scared to ask that though. This will do a ton of thing, but at least I shall not be helpless. It's got a little dagger. That's what Bilbo picked up. Nice job, Bilbo. The prisoner is escaping! Dude, Bilbo's like a tank with a dagger and no gear or armor, and I'm jealous. I'm actually jealous, though. Bilbo, keep running! Is a thong like a flip-flop in Australia? Oh, maybe. Thong song? What's a thong? Wait, what's a thong song? Australians wear thongs on their feet. Yeah, you were right, Dan. I've never heard of that. No, we're talking about the thong thong. Yeah, it's around. Thong, thong. Never heard of that, though. Never knew that was an Aussie term for, like, flip-flops. It's hard to see when you're in the clutches of goblins. That would have been at the end of my tale and thorns both, if not for Gandalf. But this time Gandalf is in near at hand. Heh. <laughs> Sun OG, I never once considered someone might not know the thong song. <laughs> ah, Bart, I love that song, man. Such a boomer song? 
<laughs> Dan, wait, did someone say thong song? OMG, what are we talking about? Yeah, apparently there's a thong song. Like Arthur, I used to tell them jandals, short for Japanese sandals, but I understand that has fallen out of use. Oh, you used to call them that. Jandals. I don't think goblins are Aussie, though. You're right, Gadget. Goblins are not Aussie. Oh, golly. My lag, man. It's my internet today. I apologize. You guys are absolutely bonkers. <laughs> no, I've never heard of a thong song. Alice, uh, Alisa, you said, I think so, in Aussie. Oh, she's confirming. Confirming the, uh, Australian thong. Level 125, the Wells of Langfoot I got completed. What's going on, Durin? I hope this message finds you well and that you found success in your adventures to the south. I beg you to remember your good friend Durin and other dwarfs. Uh, they're not concluded and we need your strength and wisdom. Return to him in Arid Mithrin, the Great Mountain. I'll meet you by the Stable Master. But I'm not there yet, buddy. I'm not there. Clearly just a misunderstanding. <laughs> Questing, Dad. Thanks for the raid. Welcome in, raiders. How you doing today? I almost said this morning. <laughs> it is far from morning. It is nighttime. Aw, uh, thanks, man. Thanks for the raid. Welcome in, raiders. How you doing today? Uh, give me one second. I'll give you a shout out. We were doing the further adventures of Bilbo. Um, when I was talking, when I was walking the mountains, I was captured by a party of goblins and they started hauling me to the camp. We had gone no more than a hundred feet or so. The second protocol of creatures came by, led by this fellow. Now I wouldn't say I'm an expert on goblin kind, but I have had enough run-ins with them to know that they love gold more than anything. So I had to think fast and well, I told them I, I've been an adventurer in my younger days and I had hidden sacks of gold in the mountains. <laughs> Wow, Bilbo. What a guy. Uh, thanks for the Raven. Uh, how was your stream today, Questin' Dad? How was it? What were you doing? Playing Lotro, of course. What are you guys doing? It's not... It's Thursday. I don't know if you guys have, like, a Thursday stream planned. I know Saturdays are Hobbit nights for you guys. I think. Hey, Seabates. Q, hello, hello. Uh, so you guys walked in on an interesting time. We were talking about... So, uh, someone said, okay, there was a goblin that said something about throng, and then people thought that he said thong, and now we're talking about thongs, and we're learning about a thong song, which I've never heard in my life. And then also, Australian thong is apparently like flip flops, is what they mean when they say, I, I guess, like when Aussies say thongs and they might be referring to flip-flops so we're learning a lot about thongs tonight right now okay um <laughs> oh okay australians didn't like that word so they thought that thong was more appropriate <laughs> okay python dad hey Sc uh, scandals when you wear sandals with socks socks and sandals bring it back socks and sandals what 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 there's a whole song I enjoyed the wells area. Ooh, I'm excited for it. Can't believe we're 125. I feel like we're just flying by. Stunning Steve got someone not knowing the thong song makes me feel old. <laughs> I'm sorry. I've just never, I've never heard of a thong song. Okay. I just like, what is the song? I don't know. I just... <laughs> oh man. Oh man. Working on quests in Gondor. Oh sweet man. Man, like, that's, like, not too far from where I'm at, man. Question in Gondor. Ooh, you guys aren't going to be too far away from Mordor soon. It's so wild. Hope you're liking Gondor. Gondor is such a blast. Absolutely loved it. Danny said, Wells is awesome. You'll love it. Okay, everybody's so, like, thrilled with Wells. I'm excited now. Danny said, oh, yes. Well, you need to listen to that song. It's straight 90s song. Cisco, I think? Sunning Steve, I agree with you. LOL's epic song. I totally play it right now, but I probably get like a copyright strike, so I can't. But like, I'm telling you guys, I will be listening to the thong song after stream. 
All right, Bilbo also says the goblins fought among themselves for the right to my treasure, just as I thought they would. This fellow won the contest right quickly, before I could get away, and the next thing I knew, I was locked in that cell here in Goblin Town. I couldn't tell them the truth, of course, that there were no sacks of gold. When I ventured with the dwarves, I did end up with two small chests of silver and of gold. That was a long time ago, and they were never as large as the rumors around the hill would put them. <laughs> of course. Think I've got it. You'll get us out of this, trust me. You have an idea? Of course, Bilbo. Bilbo's always got an idea, right? Uh, you've already proven yourself to be a most effective fighter. Fork tongue? I'm sorry, I just now saw this. Dan, you're friendly, you're family friendly. You do not want to play it on here, okay? <laughs> this is why I've never heard of a thing called a dog song, man, okay? I try, uh, I try to stay away from, uh, you know, stuff, uh, stuff I find questionable, we'll say. Uh, what would you say to another contest? I'm listening. Bar, you said my mom and dad probably were listening to that song when they were... <laughs> okay, I didn't need to know that. Okay, I, I get, I get the song, okay? You said my, my, you say the dog song is innocent. You guys are literally telling me it is not innocent. <laughs> It's far from. Why are we talking? Okay, Bilbo has a contest, apparently. Okay, he agrees to the contest. Single combat seems fair to me. No one can intervene. This will be a test of strength one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, are you prepared to fight? Oh, wait, I'm the one fighting him. Okay, that's easy. I was like, if Bilbo's gonna fight this guy, I don't know. To be single combat, yes, one-on-one, -on -one. correct. But I never agreed to be the one you will be fighting. Alright, that's fair. Bring a minion. <laughs> Goblins cannot be trusted. Bro, literally, you have more health than your troll guy, okay? He might have more, like, you know, dominance damage, but... <laughs> Bilbo ran to the side, he was like, I can't. Bring it on, bro. Well, I could just insta-kill the guy. Oh. I won the contest! It looks like we won! Yeah, that was really easy. Dog song isn't innocent, but it's not that bad of a song either. <laughs> Questing Dad, it's a classic nowadays, the thong song that is. Man, I'm missing out on the classics. Alright, man, I'll have to listen to it, you know? I don't know what to expect, but I'll let you know. Maybe I'll do like a live reaction on the Discord. <laughs> I'll be like, guys, this is my live reaction to the thong song on Discord. <laughs> I can't, bro. I just can't with y'all. But yeah, thank you, Questing Dad, for the raid. It means a lot, so I really appreciate it. Ho ho ho! Uh, yeah, sorry that you, uh, you know, you rated us on a very interesting conversation. Um, yeah. Dan, you say, yeah, it's not horrible. Rump shaker is, um, yeah, but Long <laughs> Song could be worse, but is it? Whoa! <laughs> Alright, you made your point. Oh god, get out of here with your friend before I change my mind. Oh man, he actually abided by his word. Well, I am too. We are no longer just a tutorial character. Yay! That means I invite you, Ganto. Gantoron. Do. All right, did it. We got Bilbo out. Chapter 10 complete. Thank you so much for finding Bilbo and bringing him back to safety. Now I can finally ask Bilbo the important question for which I saw him in the first place and which his absence made impossible to answer. What was it? Oh, I will ask him myself after he's rested from the ordeal. It involved the rhyme scheme of a song I'm composing. Really? All of this for a song? It's quite a talent for such things. Oh my gosh. I'm actually upset all of this was for a song. Like, come on, man. Anytime now I shall lurk while I get something sent and draw your shirt. Yeah! Thank you. I appreciate it. Have a good lurk. Get your things done, sir. 
All right, you guys want to go see Bill Bill in the Hall of Fire? It's so nice that the Hall of Fire now has its own hallway. And you don't have to, like, teleport in. I don't know why. It's just such a nice feature to have now. Hello there. All right. I hope you will accept my apology for causing any trouble. Elrond's already spoke to me about his fear that I intended to follow young Frodo and the others. And I'll tell you, as I told him, so such thing was not on my mind. I simply wanted to take a walk in the crisp, clear air of mountains. It's quite a nice stroll. Got to visit my old friend. Talked about the adventure days. Uh, how do you think Frodo is doing? Adventures are quite different when you're in them, aren't they? I look back on my own, and I don't remember the damp or the fear. I remember how it turned out, and not the uncertainty as it was turning. I hope Frodo and the others will be... Um, I hope uh, Frodo and the others with him are as fortunate as I was. Aww. That's so cute. Oh, we even got our XP. Oh yeah, the 3000 XP. Bilbo, you're just so good. You're such a good chap. Such a good lad. Mm, oh, I remember these quests. Yeah, I've never actually f done them all. The hallway of fire leads to the hall of fire. <laughs> this is true. This is true. Look at Gantron, his little level 7 warden. I'm so proud. He's making a warden on Crick Hollow now. Back again. <laughs> Here you <old>, back again. <laughs> kind of a title. Uh, yeah, apparently these are repeatable. Okay, well, kind of suck. Oh, wait! Oh, we. We're so close to getting a cosmetic pet. Okay, let's do. Let's do a. Let's do another one. I get two tokens. It's the first one. You should collab with him. He's on Crick. Who? Who you say, well, Dan? But not before. Say Gantron questing Dan? Do, do, do. Elrond. I'm just doing this tutorial to get my uh my tokens, Elrond. Don't mind me, please. Mm -hmm. Man, look at how many marks I have. Oh man, that's a lot. Twenty six thousand marks. Token to further adventure is capped at 500. That's intriguing. Gantaron, didn't he just make a seven? Yeah, yeah, we're in a fellow right now. <laughs> now you have a Crick Hollow Warden bestie. Heck yeah. Oh, that was the point of all of this. Gantaron was to make a. <laughs> so make a, a Crick Hollow Warden bestie. I see. Wait, you made a Stalax Dwarf too. Nice! I didn't even realize it was a Stalax Dwarf. Look at Gantaron's dwarf, man. Looking mighty tough. He's like, face me. Alright, I'm sorry. Um, you see... Dot dot dot. Elrond's not having it. Uriel wished to ask you something. Yeah, what is it? Um, okay. I'm just gonna speak with Arwen. Outside the entrance of the house. Glorfindel's to the south. Arwen, you looked so freaking gorgeous, my lady. If only I could be just as pretty as you one day. <laughs> Gantaron, maybe, dot dot dot. <laughs> heck yeah, man, heck yeah. Look at Gantaron, he's a true, he's a true friend, you know? He's like, I will make a character for you to have a warden bestie. I will do it. To help you. Here he comes. Elrond, where are you? That was it? Okay, that really is only gonna give me like two tokens, yeah? I guess we should do all of the chapters repeatable because I want to get as many tokens as I can. Even though the XP is gonna really hurt me. I really don't want to stone a tortoise. I really don't, but I might need it. Orifile may have seen our missing hobbit. The trick may be getting him to tell us. Bring it on. Ooh, I need this for a deed.
Missions, man. Gotta love those missions. Arthur, if you need even uh, even more tokens, oh, the furthest dimension of yeah, I don't have those though actually. Ah, oh, dang it, I don't have that. I haven't. That's like the one quest pack I don't. Well, actually, I'm a VIP, so I might actually. Huh? Now I'm like, let me look. Which restore always acts up for me anyway. Dan, oh, you know about the Stone of Tortoise? I would have it all. I would have. I would have had it on during all Spring Fest. Yeah. I just don't. As weird as this is gonna say, I don't believe in it. No, I just like. I. I don't know. I like to. I like to progress. I like to level. The problem is, is that I am not leveling my main story right now. And like right now, we just got the wells, but I still have so much more to do with the Grey Mountain stuff right now that it's just... I don't want to like overdo it, you know? I want to make sure that I'm keeping up with my main story. But it's like I'm, I'm too far ahead now, which gets rough. Means I can't do side quests, which kind of sucks. VIP has access to those missions. Sweet! That's what I thought. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Where do, uh, where do I get access to them then? Like, where do I go to start them? No sign of missing Hobbit. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Hobbit missing. I know, I'm upset too. He's gone. Okay, look at my height though, compared to this. I'm li I don't even come up to his knee. <clears throat> Uh, oh, hide in here. Hide in here. Don't come out. Okay, it's literally invisible. Uh. Guy, you're not in hiding. Did I not do it quick enough? Uh-oh. I think I glitched it. I think I hid just in time. But I, I guess I didn't hide for him to get in here. Or maybe they're just both talking. Maybe I'm just... Maybe it's okay. Starts with Alron, Okay. Igarthe, I finally got the giant flower on Crick. That makes three servers I have it now. Nice. I should get the giant flower. I didn't even think about getting that. I don't side with evil folk. Uh-oh. What is that smell? You don't smell anything. Did some tiny creature take him for a walk? No. I love that little... He doesn't hide and he always finds you. <laughs> yeah, you don't see me. Is this like a, like a giant bed? No, not wood trolls. Ooh, he's on to something. Uh-oh. No, you don't see me! I smell this tiny pest. Well, so much for hiding. We've done diddly bad. Mission reward. Who you think you is, John Cena? <laughs> it's John Cena! Da da da! Da 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 da! Rather than after trying for days in the same the gathering room, session, I now have two giant flowers! Gotta love RNG, right? Always. It's always how it works. So you get the flowers from gathering the the actual flowers, like the patches of flowers along uh, Bree. I have to descend southwest. Their campsite. Do... You can't see me! <laughs> Heck yeah, am I? You're right, though. Oh, Gantaron's looking a little rough there. Taking some damage. If only I could heal from afar. It'd be a sick trait to do. I'll just, like, do, like, a one- a one-time skill where you can heal someone from far, far away. It's like some Galadriel kind of stuff. 
I'll just be in their head and I'll heal them. I'll give them hope. <laughs> Dad mode, gross, I hate troll shaws. I'm not a big fan of it either, but we're just working on the, uh, the missions, I guess, for uh, the further adventures of Bilbo. Because it was a quest for me, and then also, um, I'd never done them, totally. And I want to get the cosmetic pets associated with them, so... Trying to get some of those tokens by doing those dailies right now. <laughs> Too many bees for us to speak in peace. All right, I have to keep going down. I can already hear you in my head. Exactly, Cantor. <laughs> See, I'm like Galadriel, okay? It's confirmed. Gantaron can hear me. In his head. Sounds a little concerning, but... I just unlocked East Gondor pack last night, so having fun with new content again. Yes, Tapo Gaming! Dude, that's a really exciting part. Dude, Gondor is a lot of fun. I love Gondor. I can't wait to redo that. That and the Great Company, I'm just really looking forward to. Really looking forward to all that stuff. It's almost 11. Yikes. I need to go to bed soon. We're gonna do this last chapter and then probably wrap up stream. The last chapter after this. <laughs> he always blames the flies, but he makes such much noise. <laughs> I love how the NPCs always banter about one another. I'm just gonna aggro these guys here too, might as well. Weird hydrate! Get her on in your head, in your head, zombie, zombie, zombie. My sing is 10 out of 10, you can tell me, I know. <laughs> so far from, guys, it's so far from. Woo, thanks for that weird hydrate. That was refreshing, to say the least. You know zombie, but not thong song? Yes! My mom raised me, okay? She raised me under a very strict censorship of songs that I could listen to, shows that I could watch, and movies, okay? I don't think the thong song would be something that she would put on the list of things I should listen to. But yes, zombie... I mean, that one was okay. 10 out of 10 would tell you again. Oh, Gadget, that was that was quite uh, a thing, weird lady. <laughs> it was a magical performance, okay, Gadget? I just gave you like a 20 out of 10 performance, okay? I see. Nobody can appreciate my art. Mm. <laughs> no, you're right. That was, that was, uh, oof. Plus 10 on the song choice, minus 10 on the execution. <laughs> oh, my heart, y'all. Y'all are just, y'all are just hurting me now, okay? You don't, you don't gotta, you gotta, like, put it down that hard, man, okay? We need an Aubrey Reacts 2 series where you have a special guest each time. Yeah, a lot of people have been asking me lately for Reacts, and I'm kind of like, maybe I'll put it, like, together on, like, I don't know. On something. Do you react on like Patreon or like Discord or something? It's tempting. Now obviously your mother will need to come watch the thong song. <laughs> I don't know. She she I'm sure she knows it. Is this you, Eek Arthur? Is this you showing off your flowers? 
This is somebody with flowers. Gadget, a zombie was about boys that died fighting in the Troubles in Northern Ireland, wasn't it? I have no idea. Absolutely no idea. I just know it, it's like a popular song, okay? That's all I know. Oh, I didn't mean to stab you. I'm so sorry. I'm just stabbing this person. Oh, they're on my friends list. Yeah, that's what Zombie was about. That's what Dan says, yes. Just don't let her watch my intro. Oh, she won't care. Do okay, my mom is like... It's like this, guys, okay? My mom, she makes these candles, okay? She runs a little candle company. I understand that Bilbo once adventured with and her candle no company, her bestseller is... Has he seen Bilbo lately? The 18 plus section of candles, we'll say. So, um, if that tells you anything. My mom is like the most open person, but when I was growing up, she definitely wanted to censor me from things, which I get. Has Aubrey seen your channel trailer yet? Ooh, I have not seen Toadster's channel trailer yet, no. Garther, hope you're not allergic to flowers. Nope. Luckily, I'm not, thankfully, okay? But those flowers, man. Whew, gorgeous. No, you will understand when you watch it. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, I don't. <laughs> now I'm all like stressed. I'm like, what's going on? Like, <laughs> all right, this is the last chapter, and then we're gonna wrap. Does she make uh, yes, yes, Ganteron. That is what she makes. That's one of them. She makes a lot of interesting candles. She is very, uh, she's very diverse with her, with her candle making. <laughs> Pride is a great, uh, is a great time for her. She's a very interesting person. Uh, what do you report? Terrible snow squall approaches. Oh. Oh, my nose is tickly. It's those flowers, man. Maybe I am allergic. They tickled my nose. Do you tell me long beards run fearful before a little snow? Uh, nay, but this one drives a horde of snow beasts before it. A horde, you say? How many creatures did you see? Too many to count, and they come this way! No! Heck yeah, Ganthron's like, where can I get some? <laughs> yeah, she's a, she's a very open ma'am. Man, I'm getting tired. I'm so tired. Is uh, Sally still streaming? Do you guys know? Holy. <laughs> He's like, oh, I see it now. <laughs> okay, yeah, these are a frick ton of snow beasts. I guess I should start getting my controls together, yeah? Yeah, he was not kidding when he said a horde of snow beasts. Man, they just keep coming. Huey said sneak she is. <laughs> I'm pretty sure phallic shaped candles are easy to find. <laughs> Maybe. Sal is still streaming, I mean. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I was like, what? <laughs> okay, that makes a lot more sense. I was a little confused by that. Mm, what were we talking about before we were interrupted? <laughs> you already forgot about what we were talking about. It's okay, I did too, sir. It's all right. Do, 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 do. I understand Bilbo. Has he seen Bilbo? Wait, what's going on here? 
Oh, I don't know. That was weird. Anyway, uh, what should we get? Do we get the bog lurkers, a friendly bear cub, or a black bear cub? Let's get the friendly bear cub. Well, I don't know. Maybe we get the black bear cub. I don't know. I don't know! I don't know at all! <sighs> I don't know. Here, let's look at the collections. See which one's cuter. Uh, we're looking at the black bear cub. Oh, he's so cute! He looks so furry and friendly. Alright, then there's the friendly bear cub. Uh, he looks cute too. Uh, the adventure bog lurker, adventure swan. And then the bog lurker buddy. Aren't these bog lurkers like miniature size? I really like that. A cutie. Bog lurker buddy. Bog. Bog. Aubrey. Alphabet. Why do I not see it? Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh, he's so cute. <laughs> Sneak was like question mark. It, it was a typo, I guess. Sneak. I guess, I guess like, uh, I think Q was trying to tell me that Sally was life, but then... Said... S uh, yeah, I don't know what happened, but yeah. Okay, but who was going to pay the bill, though? I don't know. Bill bill? Bilbo can pay the bill, though. Get it? There's a search bar at the top, by the way. Oh, yeah, I mean, I... I <laughs> See, I know this stuff. I, I promise you guys I know this stuff. It's just that I... I forget often. Okay? <laughs> I forget often. I literally, like, choked up on that. Uh, let's get the Black Bear Cup, shall we? What's a cutie patootie? Alright. Uh, where's the black bear cub at? Oh, and we got a moth kite today, too. <gasps> Aw, his name is Burly. He's so cute. Look at him, he's even smiling. Ah, he's so cute. Oh, I love him. Okay, you're my new bestie. I like you a lot. You look so happy, boy. What a happy bear. He looks so happy. Okay, this angle, he looks like he's seen something he just can't unsee. He he listened to the thong song. That's what happened. No one, so you can buy a heavy war seed, or do you need to quest to get the other types of war seeds? Um. Oh, I cannot remember. I thought you got to choose, depending on your class. You'd have access to all of them. I thought I thought it was like the light war seeds only went to like minis and stuff like that, like the light armored people. Medium armor got a choice between light or medium, and then heavy got like you know like your guardians and stuff. They got choice to all three. I thought that's how it worked, but I could be so wrong because it's been so long. Can only get light and medium with low trope points. Or light and heavy with low trope points. Really? Wait! You can pick any you want, you say snake? Q, you say you could choose a, a bridle, but the war sea light heavy are unlocked in the store? There's no way! It did not used to be like that! I thought you would get- I thought the- the bridal you could change always, but I thought that you could get a light one based on your class. Medium is the default, everyone gets that. Wow. Wild. I don't like medium. Light's actually my go-to. I don't like heavy. Never liked a heavy. Alright, well, now the hard part is which- Alright, this is the moth kite? Where is it? Where's the kite? Hello? Oh, there it is. The moth kite. It looks so cute. Look at that cute kite. Man, this is like such a pretty gorgeous screenshot. 
Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Oh, I do have more shrooms to use. Um, alrighty. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Looks like I'm gonna have to craft soon, but I don't know what to craft. Greetings to you. Take me to your stables. I don't know which one I want to replace. I'll replace the wolf dog. Oh. Oh, makes me sad. I don't like replacing the wolf dog. Southbury, thank you. Alex, always be crying. Always be crying, man. Always. All right, we're finally. All right. Um, let's get back to the festival grounds, and then we will wrap for tonight. Um, there are light, medium, heavy bridles, but there are also light, medium, heavy war steeds. Wow. That's wild. Very wild. Learning a lot. I don't really focus on war steed stuff anymore, so any changes that they've ever made, I really don't recall. It's nothing- it's never been anything I really paid attention to. Frog Jelly is still here. Fishing away. Oh, hey! I know this fella. Chap. I'm not used to him in this outfit, though. Almost rec unrecognizable to me. Man, I didn't realize your elf had such long hair, Q. I feel like I'm chasing you. Run, Q! Run! I'm gonna get ya! I'm gonna get ya with me on my kite! <laughs> I don't know what we are doing, man. <laughs> I'm gonna have my friendly bear attack you. Back off, bruh. <laughs> hey! Gantaron! Dang, Gantaron's like all freaking... Look at that armor! He is like ready to go, man. He is buffed the frick up. He's like, I am ready to defeat some people. Cheers to Gantaron. Oh, well, it was nice to run into you, Q, uh, near the end of the stream. Ha ha! And Gantaron, it was nice to see you and your new character, your little warden dwarf. Your dwarf, your, your, your. Your war dwarf, your 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 dwarf war, your your du dwarven war. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Your your yeah, your things. Um yeah. Anyway, let's go. Time to wrap it up. How the hell did you get that horse? That goat. That goat is so cute though. Please don't tell me it's something I had to spend me throw on. It probably is a steed I have to spin me through on. There's just so many seeds that require mithril. It is! Uh, it's so gorgeous! Why is that actually a dorps, though? I want mithril. Mithril coin, yeah. Dwarden! Yes, thank you, Sneak. A Dwarden. It's nice to see the Dwarden. Okay, well, I'm just gonna cry. Wait. That's how you do it? That's how you get up there? Okay, well, the hobby horse is not helping me. I don't know how I ended up. Oh, oh. Me and Gantaron, we're trying, man. We're like, please. Oh, oh, <laughs> I fell off.
No, I fell. Get me back up there, please. Please, please. Help. <laughs> Help. It's a run and jump, huh? Okay. Get on this. See, okay, I want to end the the thing here, you know? We, we want to get up top with our friends. We need to join. Okay, go jump. Jump on it! Golly. Fine, I'll try this one. Okay, no, I'll try this one. Oh, I made it that time. Not on fire! Oh, there it is. Dang, Q made this look so easy. I keep going through the wall. I'm so sorry. Oh, there I go. No! I over- Oh my god, I barely jiggled. I barely jiggled. Do you know that song, Jump On It? I do know that song, Jump On It, Dan. Oh. Oh. No! Oh my god, I messed it up. Oh, okay. Then we call a horse, and then you jump it up here. Oh, can't around over jumped it. How do I run and jump, though? Oh my gosh, I fell. Are you- How the frick do you do this, Q? Okay? How do you do this? How do you do it? Last jump, you gotta be mounted. Oh my god. Oh, Gantaron! He fell off! I saw that! Oh. Dude, I keep going in and out. I can't tell. <laughs> man, Gantaron, we're trying so hard, man. Oh. How do you do this, man? I keep blacking. Oh. <laughs> Uh, okay. Like, do you run and jump it, or what? How do I jump? That's the problem. I can't run and jump it. Like, how do you... How do you run and jump it? You at the Fossey Beverage Fest, you can use that to jump high when you sneeze on the chew. Hit the jump button, you do that jump three times as high. Man, I wish I had that, but I unfortunately don't. I did it! I did it! I did it! I did it! Hurrah! <laughs> All right, Gantron, I learned it. You just have to be on like the edge, and then like I just mounted, and then I jumped up where I'm at right now. Like I went sideways. That goes. Yeah, like go like like sideways and jump it. Yeah, yeah, perfect. There you go. You did it. You did it. Let's go. <laughs> Yay! Now Aubrey can sleep. Exactly. <laughs> you shall not pass. <laughs> <Da -doom. laughs> we're, we're facing off <laughs> via banners. <sighs> Gotta tap forward then jump almost immediately. But left off the forward key. Oh, let off the forward key so you don't jump over. Okay. I got you. Thank you, Q. Alright, let's get together. We're gonna wrap up stream this way. <laughs> Dude, I'm gonna go. <laughs> I know exactly how this is gonna go. I'm literally going to log back in. And I'm gonna be like, how the heck did I do this? And then I'll never wanna like let go, you know? Alright. Oh yeah, Pato Bear, Pato Bear. Uh what if I swashbuckled? What if I fell by swashbuckling? <laughs> He's so funny. <laughs> I can't pose. All right, let's go figure out who we're gonna go raid. I think we go raid uh, Sally. Yeah. Oh, Poteen's also streaming. Oh, and oh, and Tejog is. Uh, she's also streaming, but she's just chatting right now. She looks so familiar. Like she looks like someone I know. Like IRL. All right, Sally is uh streaming. Been three hours strong, dude. Sally. She's drinking something and it looks like a big Slurpee and now all I want is like a freezy. I haven't had an icy like a freezy in forever. All right, let's go right, Sally. You know how it is. Sal Salin. 
Nguyen, I can never say her her name anyway um yes thank you guys for being here i appreciate all the subs all the biddies all the follows all the chit chat make sure you check out the warren video if you have not i pinned it on both the chats on youtube side and on twitch side um what else i'll be live tomorrow at 1 p.m est uh <laughs> it's around it looked like you were patting my character's boob <laughs> That looked so weird. Anyway, um, gadget. Yeah, you have a good night. You have a good night. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll be live tomorrow at one p.m. EST doing more Spring Fest, and then we'll also focus on a uh, main story quest as well. Uh, copy and paste the raid message and the sub raid message if you are subscribed. Uh yeah. Um, I think that's it. I'll be streaming Saturday as well. Oh. I want, uh, I want the, I want the bear, the ghost bear. He's so cool. Anyway, um, yeah, I'll be, <laughs> no, bar. I know, I'm sorry. But yeah, I'll be live tomorrow, 1 p.m. EST, more Lotro. Uh, and then we'll also have Dwarven Ladies tomorrow as well. Uh, Last Shire Hobby, yes, thanks for being here. I appreciate following up. Uh, bar, yeah, you have a good night as well. Take care. Saturday, I'll be live later in the afternoon as well, too. Um, so yeah, that's all guys. Like the ghost bear name, what is the bear name? The bear name is Don't Pat the Boob. All right, well, we raided on that note. <laughs> okay, uh, well, Ooh. uh, yeah, anyway, have a good night.